Pink Poodle Crafts, join the Poodle Pack. It's time to get creative and make you laugh. Make your own art today. Pink Poodle Crafts is the way. What a good boy. I keep waiting on him to go. What <laughs> Scooby does? Hello, everybody. <laughs> Hello. Hi, everybody. What you doing? Hi, Janie and Sandy and Gail and Crafty Kitty and Kathy. Hi, Janie. And Escalabre and Kathleen and Shannon and Angela. Is there two Angelas? Hey, Cheryl. Yeah. Two Angelas and Monica. And is there Cheryl? Where did I miss that? Cheryl Johnson. Oh, sure. You mean? Oh, oh, there she is. Yeah. I was like, where did I miss that? <laughs> Cheryl, and Michelle, Vicky. and Anita, and Tori, and Vicky, and River, and Anita. I think I said that already. And uh, Crafty Kitty, Ray, and Sherry Flanagan, and Judy, and Debbie, and Janice and Tina, Tana, sorry. Hi, Donna. And Sandy and Lisa. Is that Tana? Tana, yeah. Hi, Janice. Hi, Donna and Julie. You sold your first journal, Lisa? Awesome. That's great. What's everybody doing today? Anything interesting? Hi, Anita. You're going to make the a ACV water? What's that? Yeah, what's that? It is Romper Room, Angel. And I see Angel. Hi, and Lisa, Angel. And Judy. <laughs> You're putting together mystery poodle packages? Ooh, Ooh mystery. <laughs> Hi, Tracy. Hi, Tracy. Haven't seen you in a little while. Where have you been? And Melody and retired and prepping. Yeah. It's like Becky. we're retired and prepping. I know. <laughs> we? Oh, we're tired. We're both exhausted. Hello, Samantha. Juliet. Where's Juliet? I don't know. And Kathleen. I think I said hello to that. Yeah. Oh, you mean Julie? Well, oh, apple cider vinegar. Somebody said oh, Juliet. Oh, okay, okay. I thought she said Julie. Julie. I didn't see a Juliet. It was something. Ooh. Like Mother's Day project and went to see the new Avengers movie. Ooh, fun. Fun. Hi, Kennedy. Did you have a good graduation? You're officially a graduate. Yay, Kennedy. No more high school. Congratulations. You ain't a baby no more. All grown up. Now get a job and start paying rent. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Patricia. Hi, Patricia. Yeah, my thing is going again. Oh, down here, whenever this oh. turns anything other than green, it usually means there's a problem. And I don't know what the problem is at this point. Well, all right. Well, what do you want to start? Well, we're going to start showing you. We went to the creative reuse and got lots of stuff, including this piece of glass right here. This is a piece of glass. It's wet on the other side because I was cleaning it and it's still not completely clean yet. But like, I found a piece of tempered glass, a nice big piece, bigger than the Tim Holtz craft mat, but not quite big enough for my big door thing. But I mean, it's not that big. It's probably, if this is 12 inches, it's 12. 
13, 13, 14, 14, maybe 14 and a half, 15 inches by the same. Yeah, a little bit longer this way. So probably like 16 or 18 inches this way. Let's tell you here. If this is 15 inches, 15, 20, 16, 17, 10, yeah, 20. So it's 20 by like 16. 15 by 16. So 16 by 20. 16 by 20 piece of tempered glass. I'm going to cancel my Tim Holtz because I'm over it. I don't want it anymore. I'm done. I'm going to just get my money back on that and get something else or whatever. But I, this is fine. This works for me. And then I have this other one. If I need a grid for anything, if I need to measure anything, I'll have that one right next to it. So this is my Tim Holtz glass mat. Oh, Pauline's going to entertain you for a few minutes and chat with you while I go take the pie out of the oven. I'll be back in two seconds. Yay. She's going to sing. Hi, Karen. Them. Sing a song for them, Paul. <laughs> right. Come on. Yeah. Who's going to breakfast, Janie? Yeah, it's a cherry pie, Angel. Nice cherry pie with ice cream. I am at Stacy's, Janie. Right here. Yes, Crafty Kitty. Oh, maybe she will, Janie. Hi, Elizabeth. Is that mom? No, it's Elizabeth Gibson. Oh, Elizabeth Gibson, hello. Yeah, we got cherry pie and vanilla ice cream. Ooh, cupcakes. You gonna be jealous. Oh, I don't care about cupcakes. <laughs> yeah. Cupcakes don't count. Cherry pie with vanilla ice cream is better than cupcakes. Ooh -wee. But I'm sure your cupcakes were very fun from your graduation. I'm sure they were yummy. Yeah. Now we can keep an eye on the girls. I only keep an eye on her Hi, potty Ray. pads. I only have the camera set so that her potty pads show. So I make sure she, because she don't do nothing else, <laughs> but eat her potty pads sometimes. Yeah. But her, I have to make sure if she poops, I go in and get it immediately. Or her, really, but her mostly because she will poop and then smear it all over. Oh, goodness. Yeah. So I keep an eye every now and again. Watch for a code brown okay. on the white mats. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Mary Hi, Jane. Mary Jane. <laughs> Hi, Mom. Hi, Joyce. Mom had cupcakes and ice cream, too. Hi, Lizzie. Lucky. Well, we went to the Creative Reuse, and we got lots of fun things, and we're happy, too. And See, Mom, look, I got a new craft mat. It's my new Tim Holtz craft mat. <laughs> it's called the Tim Holtz Clear, <laughs> and it was free. Yep. Hi, my crafty journey. Hello. Crafty journey. Yes, if you don't know, this is Miss Pauline Whitehead. Um, right here. Hello. She came up to help me out and to go to the craft store or the craft re whatever the hell it's called. Hi, Amber Moon. And we had fun today. We had lunch. We went to the creative reuse and then we came back and worked for like what an hour and a half and then sat down <laughs> yeah <laughs> maybe if that <laughs> we had fun though yeah i'm gonna go get a bag of stuff i'm gonna move that out of the way get a bag of stuff we have lots to show yeah well first i'll start with we're working on the etsy room yeah the, that's what we're doing the etsy room because she is my she is my adopted internet mom that's why so some of this is going to go Hi, up Amber Moon. i'm going to be put together um kits for my etsy store and some of this is going to go in it and this is um cotton twill a lot of this is cotton twill or it could be used as like a canvas because you could paint on this stuff i do it all the time yeah and use it as like journal covers because you could do like mixed media mashup on it and paint on it and then make it into a journal cover i've got that i got this which is a little heavier than I this to get a little cut in the and yeah so i can do a mixed media mashup on it there you go and then i've got some more and then i've got 
this one, which is like a, uh, it has a thing in here. It says face. I don't know what that means. <laughs> this is uh, like muslin, I guess, kind of, or maybe it's linen. It feels like a linen. Either way, these are all great to paint on or to use for whatever. Yeah. And there's more, more of this type of stuff. And then there's this type of stuff. So these are going to be fun to put up in the, yeah, these are going to be fun. I'll put, put them up in the creative reuse. I mean, I'll put them up in my Etsy when I get a chance because I think that they would make good little project grab pieces. Bags. Yeah, grab bags of fabric. And then I've got this other bag. Oh, what's that? What was that? Oh. I've got this other bag full of fabric. I'm not going to go through the whole entire thing, but again, I'm going to put together grab bags of fabric on my Etsy, and I've got a lot of good stuff for journal covers in here. Tons and tons and tons. I even got some t-shirt ribbon right here, and oh, this is a piece. This is some photo paper that I got. Anyway, um, lots of different fat quarters and Lots of colors. Yeah, lots of different colors of fabrics and different, like this one's got this cool, oh, that's cool texture to it. So be looking for that in the future. There's tons in here. I'm going to be putting together. This bag is really cool. Did they say they made it out of t-shirts? Yeah. I have to yeah, make some of these. Of them, two or three of them. Uh, I'm going to make some of these. These are cool. They here, hold a lot. Right here and I can oh, it back over here behind thanks. me. Give me them. And then I got stuff for my wheel. I got this box, which I want to paint. I got some clear embossing powder. I got some, this embossing powder, which is like some weird weathered white embossing powder, which looked interesting. And then this neon paint, which, neon paint, it says Anita's glow paint. And then this box, which I thought if I cleaned it up and painted it, it would be cute. That's yours. Okay. That's your crackle. That's your triple pick. Oh, these are my. I found these arrowhead things. I don't know if they're oh, real. Cool. They're hand chip stone arrowheads. I don't think they're real arrow arrowheads. I think they're just like somebody like they were made for like a replica reason. But they had them there, and I thought they would make cool jewelry if I wrap wire around them. Oh, I like that one. They're cute. Yeah, because there's your special yeah. and your brayer. And oh yeah, that's yours. Oh, they printed arrows on them. That's cute. Yeah. And then my calligraphy set. And then yeah, you got all that embossing powder in there. And then we were gonna split this up. Because I found this on the wall and I was like, well, that, that looks good. And it's like a some sort of a basket weave type of texture or something. I don't know what this is, but it's, it's cool fun looking. Yeah, it's cool. I thought this would be fun for some texture. So I'm going to cut it in half. Yes, this is the Stacy Evans. This is the pink poodle mat. <laughs> I'll put a piece of paper behind it, a pink paper behind it. The Tim Holtz shove it mat. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> The screw you Tim Holtz mat. No, I like Tim Holtz, but I'm not happy with the mat situation. So I'm, I'm over it. I'm over it now. I bet. I wonder how many people did the same thing. Like just were like, forget it. I don't Didn't need it. Did you say it. you ordered it in January? Yeah. Five months. That's crazy. Yeah. I'm over it. I thought that was two, the way that it was laid in. Oh, it no. It looked like it was two, didn't it? Yeah, it's plenty. Yeah, welcome. Well, you can probably use this better than I can. I don't need that. I can throw that back in the bag. Is this yours or mine? Oh. It's mine. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know either. I'm lost. Do you need a shower ring? Here. No, I don't one. want it. You can use it for making things. Yeah. I got these little scrap packs that somebody put together with an old photograph. Did you see that? Yeah. I noticed that <laughs> hanging. All of them were hanging like, hanging that. like that. This I was so excited to find because I thought it was just going to be plain white. And it is on one side, so I could paint on it. But 
it's an Asian themed, you know, one of those Asian calendar things from 2010, but it's got the thing on it, the koala bears, which I love. I just thought this was so cute and I want to somehow incorporate that into my journal that I'm going to make. I don't know how. Either that or paint on the other side. But I want, I, I like the well, koala bear. you could paint bear. the bottom half. Yeah. Oh, that's true. I could. Oh, wait. What are these again? Oh, those tile things. I love the box too. Sturdy yeah. box. Different color. I thought those was cool. Of these tiles. These are what? Three by three. What are so called? you can make trashies. <laughs> and then I found this little tiny mini that blind so thing. Cute. It's like a, I don't know, like a little bamboo mat thing. I don't know what I want to do with it yet, but I just thought it was so cute. I want to do something. I could roll sushi with it. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Sushi. I could paint on it, though. I bet it would be cool if I painted on it. Yep. That, you could even use that in a journal for a flip. And I got these. Which I wasn't going to get it first, and then I kind of went back on it. But they're like finials, except no finial top. But I bet you I could take one of those wood beads and glue it on here with, with the whole side down. Yeah. And make finials out of them and even cut that off or grind that off or put, I don't know, do something with them. I just thought that was cute. charms on them. Yeah, know. that's true. So that's what I got there. Oh, did you want some of these? No, I yeah. got the little ones. Oh. The little flat ones. But thank you. I do want to open that and look at it later. And I found a calligraphy set. Yeah, I wanted to see that. And I was like, I, don't, I think that's dried up. I have to get, yeah. I have to get eight for that's it. That's neat. I've been wanting one of those. Yeah, this but is... I'd rather try it first. Well, the next time you come over, we can sit because yeah, I've got. With it. Yeah, because I'm gonna order some of the refillable inks because I need some. I have another one, and I need some of the refillable inks for it because trying to fill it up yourself is a pain in the ass. Oh, definitely. It's anything like refilling your computer ink yourself. <laughs> no, it's it's not it, it's not that it's hard. It's just it doesn't seem to work right for me for some reason. Okay, I'll throw that there. Yeah, yeah. Oh, thanks. Oh, Jamie's on top of that, Jamie. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. Pauline, I just looked up and I was like thinking of Janie and then I said that. We each got one of these calendars. It's a 2018 Aurora Borealis. I've got some other calendars, not this one, but I do have some horse calendars that are 2018. I'll put up in my Etsy, but I love the pictures on the back of here. I love Aurora Borealis. Anything. I love the gems that are Aurora Borealis, and I love, like, the I, my bucket list is to go see the Northern Lights oh, someday. Me too. Yeah. I'm totally, like, oh, yeah, one of these is yours, right? Or did you get one already? I got two. Oh, you did? Okay. Yeah. Oh, no, okay, I got three. Um, yeah, this has some cool, this is one of those Nashville Arts magazines that has, like, the cool pictures in it so that we can collage you with can it. Cut out some good words, too. Yeah, cut out words and collage pieces. And then I got this China painting workstation. Oh, cute. I don't know. It has like a little China piece and it has all the stuff it, except for the brush it looks like. But it's like this little book and it gives you a history of China. And it gives all your little miniature plates. Yeah, that's Butter. what I was thinking. Like you could just draw and that's what you're supposed to do is it teaches you, I guess, how to draw this little plate and it shows oh, you how to do it. Cute. And I thought, oh, you that is so got cute. A brush. Oh, yeah, I got a brush. Right, for it. I just thought it would be cute to try it, you know. Because I like anything Asian, so hell yeah. I was like, yep. Well, I mean, it's China. It's, it's cool. not really China. I thought it was, actually, I thought it was like a Chinese China. Like, I thought they were going to do, like, symbols. Oh, yeah, well, they kind of do, see? Not it is, really. well, the ancient art of it is Chinese, so, duh. So, you know, I, mean. I wanted to do like a Chinese pattern. I thought they had Chinese patterns in here, but I don't think they do. Aside from that one. But anyway. This is a paper crimper, but every time I seem to get one from the Creative Reefs, it doesn't work. So I'm going to test this out, and if it doesn't work, I'm going to be mad. Because, I, and this one's a little one. It's not a very big one, so it'll fit like little pieces. But... Like, I've been just wanting a paper crimper forever, and every time I find one, that doesn't work. Oh, but this one, you can hold it tighter. Oh, Ooh, this one does work. Yay! Because you can hold it tighter. Like, I didn't hold it at first. Look. Yep. I didn't hold it at first, and it didn't do it, but yeah, we like that. Yay. It's, I wish it was bigger, but 
that's okay. And then I got these slides that are kind of weird. This tape, that blue tape there on this side. Oh. The, uh, these slides look like they have dirt on them or something. They've probably been sitting for a very long time. Probably. Um, I wonder if I take yeah. a squirt of alcohol. If it'll clean them off. Try the other side too. Let them sit a minute. I don't know. And I got this, which is very gothic looking. Hi, Danina. Hi, Danina. And I got these Hi, little Mary Forrester. flowers. Hi, Rain Girl. And this little flower. Hi, Rain Girl. And Mary. And then this has, this is like looks like a bracelet, and it's got tiny it little, look like a little girl. A tiny little, um, cameos. Cameos, yep. Couldn't think of the word. I got sunglasses because I forgot mine, and then I forgot to get these out of the car. Oh, or out of the thing. <gasps> the ring. This I was excited about because it looks vintage, and if it is, I'm going to be really excited about this because it has Aurora Borealis crystals, which is my favorite. And if this is vintage, which it might be, because I can tell by the crystals, that this is worth more than what they, you know, and, and none of the crystals are missing. So this might be worth a little something, something. Because these crystals are usually, if they're vintage, are worth something. And so I grabbed this in a heartbeat. I mean, obviously it's stretched out. It was like a, some weird, meshy stuff. I'll probably tie another knot. This in does not look like it is. Looks like somebody might have just put it on there. Mm, I don't know. I'm not sure. I don't know. I don't think so. I don't want to break it, but I don't think so. I just think it was from like the 50s or yeah. something and it just stretched out because it's not plastic. Right. So if it was anything plastic, then yeah, but it's got a kind of a metal mesh stretch to it. So it must be something, but this is definitely a vintage piece. And I was like excited to see this because I love these crystals. They're my favorite. Those are my favorite. Anytime I can find those vintage crystals, I'm like, yes, please. And then I found so soft fabric paints, like a bag of them. And then I found this, um, you know, this is a copper, copper tape for soldering. Yeah. And I have some thinner one, but I wanted some thicker ones. So this is good because I have some crystals I want to do some soldering with. I should probably put this stuff back. Yeah. Let's do that. Oh, you forgot this. There. Oh. I found this, which is a different color palette than the one I have. And I have no idea if that works very well but we're gonna maybe test it is this coming clean it looks like something's coming off of it yeah I might need a little scrubbing yeah i have some of these I'm overly concerned if i can't get it yeah it'll come off it just needs to it, it looks like a rust or something maybe yeah. got stuck on it so they'll, they'll come clean they just need to soak Shove them back in here these I can put over here because I put them away. Those I want to look at. Those I'll keep. That'll keep. Set down over here. Yeah. And then we got this bag. And some of this stuff that I'm about to show you is going to go up in my Etsy as well. What's the matter? You're sick, Danina? I haven't been paying attention to the chat, so I don't know what's going on. Ow, my finger. Your voice went out? Well, that's not fun. I found a bag of... This isn't going up in my Etsy, but this is a bag of... Somebody started to break it. Break this tile. And there's some of it broken in the bottom here. And I thought, well, these pieces are nice and colorful. I'm going to continue to break them. 
and maybe use them in something. And then there were some other cool pieces. I love pieces like this because they're like oh yeah, pretty cool. Neat. Yeah, and like this, and uh, they're good to just put on things for texture and dimension and all that good stuff. But there's all kinds of stuff in there. I could take those out of my sidewalk and throw them down, have a good fit. <laughs> yeah. like, ah. And then I got these, which are pieces of vinyl flooring, I believe. And I'm going to be putting kits together with these in them. Um, like I can open one. So I'm probably going to repackage it. But I'm going to put little kits together with these because you can make inches with them, you know, or whatever. And they have really cool texture and really cool backgrounds. I like that yeah, isn't that cool? And there's all kinds of different sizes and shapes. And yep. you can cut them however you want. Yeah, I got bunches and bunches. So I'm going to put together kits for that. I don't need to go through all them. Yeah, I think this is the carpet. Oh, yeah. And then I've got little, a few of them are like little carpet pieces. So you could do the same thing. You can use them for some texture on tiles. Or you can use them as like an interesting stamp. Yeah, texture. Yeah, you can glue it to a piece of wood or glue it to a piece of plastic or something and then stamp with it. I think they would make cool stamps. So that's mostly what they are. And then we got some of this, which we're going to, whoa, split. It's kind of like a weird, it's almost like a raffia old wallpaper that has like raffia in it. Don't you think? Yeah. Like it kind of looks like raffia. Yeah, look at it. It is raffia. That's like a raffia it's wallpaper. Like a grass. Yeah, raffia is. That's something. Whatever that yeah. is. I don't know what the hell it is either. But yeah, whatever that raffia stuff is, that's what this is. And it's in like a wallpaper form. Oh, did you want to split this one? Yeah. It's not 12 a.m. in Tennessee. Aren't we in no, it's 11 o'clock in Tennessee. Unless you're in East Tennessee, which I think Joyce is. Because that would be a oh, different Happy time Mother's time. Day. It's, 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 uh, 12 wherever you are, but it's only 11 where I am. That's good. You sure? Yeah. Interesting, interesting, interesting stuff. Interesting stuff. Oh, then I got more fabric. This one's cool because it's got like silver, like metallic going through it. Isn't that pretty? Really pretty. Really pretty. And then I think this is all more of that stuff, right? Yeah, that yeah. That's more of that white fabric or right. muslin and stuff. This box. Oh, don't worry about the box of books. This one? Yeah. Oh, what's in that one? Well, here. Window arm. Oh, here's your carpet tape. Oh, yeah. Is this one? Oh, this is mine? Or are we putting it? No, that one's yours. Oh, okay. Show them our cool yeah. And then me and Pauline got these books, these wallpaper books. This one's hers. I'm gonna knock over my drink. I know it. And they have like this is fuzzy. This is like velvety, fuzzy. I don't know what it is or how to say it, but I don't have any a hard Texture. time. Yeah. So she got this one. Isn't that pretty? And this has got white fuzzy velvet. Velvet, yeah. yeah. And it's got pretty. Look at how pretty that would be for a like a journal cover. Any one of these would be really pretty. Yeah, keep going and show them that real pretty black. One. Yeah. This there one. It is. Look at that, and it's velvet. And that the whole thing is all the black is velvet. And then there's a white one. And there's another black one. So pretty. Yeah. And there's all these other patterns. I think those are the only velvet ones. Yeah. I like that one too. And there's some striped ones. Very pretty. Yeah. Knocking everything over. And then I got this one here. This one. These are cool. Yeah, this is like a. It's like, I, 
don't know. They're textured. Yeah, it's, and it's like... Almost like a vinyl. Yeah, it's weird. They look like doors. But they would be cool to even paint over them. And use them. But look at these cool oh, patterns. Isn't the brick cool? And then they've got different weird outside. That one's my favorite. The wood one, <laughs> yeah. yeah. I like that one too. But just different weird and they're like they're very textured. They feel like vinyl. Yeah. Isn't that cool? They'd make great journal covers. Yeah. This one too. It's like Beautiful. paneling. And these are like stone. Stucco and stone. They're really cool. I think Lizzie said she can't touch velvet and or the heating. Oh, does it? <laughs> I hope there's this one in there because I really like that. Ooh, I like this one too. Ooh, that's pretty. I didn't look through the whole thing. I didn't either. Ooh, this one's cool. It's like glittery almost. It's got a sheen to it. Yeah. That one does too. Mm -hmm. Tribal. Yeah. That's what they call tribal. Huh. Oh. Ooh, that color is pretty. Yeah, like a minty blue color. Black. That was modern mint. Yeah. That's pretty, pretty, pretty. Yeah, very pretty. This is grass cloth and paper weaves. So I bet that's oh. what that is. Yeah, I want, would like a piece or two out of oh, that. Oh, yeah. Let's get it. Whatever you want. Oh, I don't really want. Oh, I just want one or two pieces. Yeah, I get it. Oh, that was so much crap. But this one here is cool because it's got like grass cloth and it's like, it's like these, I don't know. There's like little wood pieces in these. I don't know what they were samples for. What were they for? Oh, window treatments. Or they're wall treatments, actually. People used to cover their walls with this crap. Cool. It's so <laughs> weird. Cool. It is cool, but I bet it was like dusty, dust collecting, big time. Um, Look at that. I'd love to get this one and make a stamp with this. Get it. That would be cool. Ooh, or, the, or this one and make a stamp yeah. with it. There's a couple pieces like that. There's that one and then there's this red one. Whatever you want. I hope so. Yeah. All right. Anyway, all kinds of fun stuff. No, they're not window shades. It's actually a wall covering. Isn't that weird? What's this that? was mine, but I showed a bunch oh, of that yeah. material stuff and all this stuff. Well, you show them all that. <laughs> oh, that's right. We got the yeah, yeah, we just got it together. Yeah. Oh, I got the stuff. She was like, you want me to grab all these? I'm like, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they make little journal friendly. Yeah. Little journals or fuzz on them. Not stuff to my finger permanently. You wanna There's all oh, these little this bits. One. Oh yeah. This one has like oh, yeah, vinyl here. pieces and like these are good for like ATC size. Yeah, it's perfect. To take these off disease. because they just like literally come off. And what size are they? Let's see. Two and a half by yeah. perfect. four. So you can cut it's it down a little, little bit. Perfect. And it'll be a cool ATC background. Oh, that's a good idea. Oh, I think I got another one. Another something. Ooh, dust is flying now. Oh, we got this Ooh, one. I want that pink one. Okay. <laughs> What's that? What are those? They're sheer. Oh, they're like sheer. Summer breeze. Summer breeze. Take me away or something. Mm. Oh, yeah. Oh, the ribbon. Oh, yeah. For the sorry ribbon. Yeah, she got a whole bunch of stuff to make sorry ribbon with. A bunch of silky we materials and some burlap. <laughs> I know it is. It's shedding yeah, everywhere. Look at this. Yep, she but got some quarters. of this. The fat quarters. There were bunches and bunches. 
pretty colors. Some pinks and purples. And some other ones. Ooh, those purple flowers Ooh. are pretty. That's not velvet. I mean suede, it's velvet. Mm. That's a piece of velvet. And I got a t-shirt bag too. Ooh, she's got a t-shirt <laughs> bag. All right, and then if you want me to take some of these and, yes, and then please. split some of these, we'll do that later. Yeah, we'll just put it over on the floor and it'll make okay. me remember. Yeah. Ooh, yeah, that made a mess. Yeah, it's going. That everywhere. made a good old mess, and same with the burlap too. If you want some of that. All right. Actually, you could just have this. I have my own burlap. If you don't have any burlap, you should take that. Okay. And use it because burlap's fun to use, and I have burlap. I don't need burlap. I got it. Um, the scrapbook paper. Oh yeah. I get it. And we also found scrapbook paper. We had all kinds of stuff at the crater we used today. I do want to see this and get this creepy photo over there. <laughs> see these vintage-esque decorations for Halloween, which I was like totally down for. You guys know I love my Halloween. Oh, those come out. Those are cute. Uh -huh. Look those at that. bags had a bunch of them, didn't they? Yeah. Love these. Hi, Jude. Hi, Jude. And we got some scrapbook paper. Take whatever you want. Okay. Mm -hmm. oh. Oh, oh, the paper clips off. Something. And this one's pretty. It's a full book. I didn't yeah, realize it was a full book. Flowers. That one's pretty. I like that one. That's probably the only one. Ooh, the paisley. That's probably the only one. Is that paisley and the other one? I want a piece of each of that, but otherwise, nope. There's oh, bones, we got bones, some bones. Digging up this bones. is bone. There's my saw. <laughs> digging up bones. Hey, this got poppies. Is that go. poppies? Split it with you. We got bone paper. Is that poppies? What? Oh, yeah, it's poppies. That's pretty. Oh, it? I love it. This is the one I I seen the cover of it. And I'm like, please let there be like more of this paper in there. And there is. Mm -hmm. Love the poppies. This must have been Ooh, pop those pop There's cutouts and all kinds of things. Yeah, there's a bunch in there. Ooh, there's four pages of that in there. I think it's four pages of each. Oh, cool. Nice. We got roses. Ooh, roses. Roses. I think this is all the same. No, it's not. I think there's oh, I thought these were all just the same. Aloha. That was pretty. There's all kinds of pretties in here. And some solid. Look. Oh, mm -hmm. pretty. Pretty, pretty. The solid pieces. Some more pieces in here. That's pretty. Look, we didn't even look through this one. No, I know. I think I grabbed that one and was like, I just oh, grabbed I it. I love that one. Ooh, that's cool. Yeah. That's, that's pretty. Uh oh. That's cool. Yeah, there's two. I don't care. You can have those. Oh, pretty. I'm just doing look, a couple sheets out of that one. There's something French or something on that. Hmm. Huh. Okay. Yeah, is that. Is Something. it French? I don't know. No, it's a zombie it sour mix. Words. These are drinks. They're I drinks like wonder. margarita, <laughs> sherry, zombie. This one has cork paper. My cork come off of this one. And it has <laughs> soda pop cans or beer cans. And that one, which is nice. And then it has this like... one. I love the cantaloupes. That's cute. And then it's got this one. But I can't see the beer. Vegetables. You can have it. Hmm. That one. looks like stained glass. Some scrap pieces. 
can't get it up for him having issues. Yeah. The veggies. <laughs> Ooh, I love twine. I love me too. I that love that. Gorgeous. Maybe there's more. Oh, yeah. that's my. Yeah, that one's pretty. Gerber. Oh, you so do. <laughs> <laughs> there is this, which is cool. I just like the border. Yeah, yeah, um, the border is cool. Get all that off. That's pretty. Cute. That's pretty. Cool. Ooh, that's cool. And let's see. I love this one. Her and I are both were like, ooh, that one's a good one. Miss uh, Elizabeth likes that kind of pattern oh, too. I love that. I fell in love she with that when I was in high school. Gerber daisies. I have that on my shower curtain in there. Really? Yeah, it's pink with that on. Oh, it. cool. I love this rose one. Ooh, that's pretty. Yeah. I think there's two. I don't know. Oh, there's another one of those patterns, but in pink. Oh, yeah. Yay. That's pretty. Mm -hmm. I can make something with it. Ah, there's Thank another you. one. <laughs> we left that. I know, right? I don't know. Birdies. Really no, no, pretty. That's pretty. That's pretty. Leaves. More daisies, are they? More yeah. Roses. And more roses. And poppy flowers. And more flowers. And more flowers. Look at those. those are yep. And more that's flowers. Pretty. I like that one too. That's pretty. Ooh, that's pretty. Ooh, that's pretty. Ooh, that's pretty. Ooh, wow, that's... Did you see Ooh, the one that was like that glass? That one. Look that. Oh, that's pretty. Got a sheen to it. And that's very pretty. So for the one that had stained glass. It looked like stained glass. It was, that was the one, beginning. one of the other ones. Oh, it was, was it? Oh, I don't know. Was it? I don't that remember. One? I don't know. Here, I'll take the, a couple pieces out of that that I wanted. Okay. This one. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Glass. It does look like stained glass. Pretty. Oh, these just got a picture. Here, get your cantaloupe. <laughs> Whatever else you want. <laughs> no, I don't want any more. Just that one. You want no babies? These. Nah. I like these, though. The po I like okay. this one. The poppy. Well, is that they are poppies? You know, my brain's like drawing a blank. I think that's it. And maybe one more than one sticker. They do, but they're different. So you can keep those. I don't know. I just want the couple Oh, you need to get some of this. What? No, I have plenty of paper like that. So, so this, you want it? Oh, this paisley. one. Yeah, I wanted the paisley one. I love this one. Yeah, they had a whole box of scrapbook paper. And we just stood there and was like grabbing stuff. I was like, here, put it in the back, put it in the back. We'll go home and look at it. <laughs> Who is the poppy paper made by? Oh, yeah. Who is that made by? I think you just passed it right there. This one? Yeah. It's called Autumn Leaves. Autumn Leaves is the company. Pretty Poppies is the name of the paper. Autumn leaves, pretty poppy. Never heard of it. Me either. Right, Did you want any of the die cuts? Nah. Five of each. That's fine. Just one of four. Oh, four of each. I'm going to make sure. Yeah. I love the pink paisley one. That is so cute. Oh, I grabbed three by accident. That's oh, okay. No. No, you can have it. I don't need it. I don't need it, woman. 
Did they have more paper? I may go tomorrow. Uh, yeah, they did. They had it in a box. I don't know if they're putting it back into the paper room or not, but they had it in a box up towards the by the register, kind of to the left of the register. So yeah, they did have more. We didn't wipe it out. <laughs> now we left some. We left a few pieces. <laughs> <laughs> no, we left a decent amount. We just grabbed a few and, and stuff goes quick there, I'll tell you that though. Whew. Do you want any of this? Mm. This is stars. Uh, did you use any of that over there? Oh, I don't know. No. That was for your other stuff. Okay. The we got stars. We we're going to decorate stars. Oh, wait, what's in here? I don't know about this stuff. Oh, yeah, we, we didn't do that yet. Oh. Well, these are mostly just books, so. I'm going to be. I've got a bunch of books, and I'm going to be putting some up on Etsy and actually some pages. Um, I got some dictionaries. I'm going to put dictionary pages up on Etsy. Elizabeth, are you still in here, Mom? Elizabeth, Mom Elizabeth, but I got these, um, these, uh, Reader's Digest, so I may put a couple of these up on Etsy. I got these and some dictionaries, I don't feel like bringing all them over here, they're heavy as hell. Hi Kennedy. Is she not in here? Did, uh, you, did mom go to bed? She's there a minute ago. Ooh, a Barbie sewing book. Huh. Some of that stuff I sent. Uh, some of that that's in the bag I grabbed from the crater for you. Yeah, and that was in the car. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, this is what you brought? Yeah. Oh. I thought I, thought I grabbed them. Well, I brought some of it. The you stuff that you some. brought are in my purse. These are the ones that I oh, grabbed from the creative reuse. Yeah, because it says national on it. That was the stack of stuff I grabbed. They okay. had it like underneath right. the table. They had a bunch of stuff under okay. the table, and I just they went. They look kind of the same. Yeah, like, those are in my purse still. I still left in my right. purse the ones that you gave me. But I just noticed Barbie sewing book. I thought that's cool. Oh, Miss Elizabeth's not here. Okay. Well, anyway, I'll show you guys. I got this little positive thought to ease stress, anxiety, worry, and fear. I'm going to send this to her. See, look. It has all those. She loves all these positive affirmations. Oh, that's cool. It's a whole book of them. A whole book. Oh, she liked that. And I got one for myself because they're a nice size where I can put them on a card. Oh. So I got one for myself to do that with. And I'm going to send one to her because she loves to read these at the end yeah. of her thing. So I'm going to give that to her. But she left the live stream, so I might not give it to her. She's a bad girl. <laughs> <I'm just kidding. laughs> but we got all kinds of good stuff. I got lots of paper, dictionary paper and the like. Like this is an old dictionary. And I'm gonna take the pages and put them up on put bundles of different papers up on Etsy. So I'll have all kinds of good stuff up there. Yeah, yeah lots pages. of pages. Um, Book pages. Is that everything? Good lord. Yeah. All right. Entertain the troops. I got a pee. <laughs> okay. Hi, Carla. Hi, Angela.
we are going to mix the media on these stars. <laughs> Kellyanne, I'll tell Stacy you said that. Hi, Angela. Hi, Holly. Oh, okay. And I'll keep them together. Because I'm not missing. Where were the other packs of these that I grabbed? I know I grabbed like four or five of these with the different things. Did they not? Did they not? Oh, there. No, yeah, that's not it. What did I do? Whoa. What did I do with them? They might be mixed up in one of my bags. I'll go look. Oh, there was a bunch of those. Yeah, and I got like five with all the Halloween and, the, and that pinup girl. I wanted to show them. I love pinup girl. Oh, that was cute. What was um not over there? Anyway. Woo! Oh, Tigger is good. He's sleeping in his chair like an old man. Hmm. I'm exhausted. I was up early this morning. Oh, that's not good. Re, how'd that happen? Oh, I'm glad you're. I'm glad you're at the hospital getting care and not, you know, was hopefully they're giving you good medicine, but it sucks that you have to be in there. And you're, what do you mean you don't seem to be getting better? It's not helping? No, Pauline didn't get me up. I got a phone call that got me up this morning. <laughs> But I had to be up anyway. Ooh, but I got good news. So I had been on the search for a handyman um, to do some painting downstairs and whatnot and some other things. And so I belong to this app for my neighborhood. And, you know, it basically you can go on there and talk about what's going on in your neighborhood, whatever. And so I was on there and I put in a thing and I said, does anybody recommend somebody who's a good handyman, whatever, you know, just somebody who's reliable and whatever, whatever. And they, a bunch of people came back and said this one guy. And so I looked up and, and somebody gave a link to his business. I looked it up and he got like a five star rating and said that he was awesome and he was so nice and genuine and, you know, honest, good guy, blah, 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 blah. He had all kinds of really good ratings, and, and he came highly, um, highly um, recommended. recommended. And so I was like, okay. So I called him, and he said, okay, I'll, you know, he'll be here at 1. He was here right at 1 o'clock. He was on time. Really nice. And we got to talking, and I was telling him what I needed done. And I was down in the basement, and I said, yeah, I'm renting it out, so I need it painted, like, as soon as possible. He's like, oh, how much you rent it out for? I said, six fifty a month plus, you know, or with all utilities and yada yada. We were talking about that, and he says, would you be interested in having me rent it out? Because he apparently shares. He's a roommate with another person, and he thinks he has a little dog, and he thinks that his roommate is like hitting his dog, and like being mean to his dog. I don't know what the story is exactly, but he says, I just want to get out of there because I don't trust him with my dog and this, that, and the other, and. And his dog is super sweet. It's a small dog. And I wasn't going to let pets, but he's a handyman. And he's willing to fix everything I needed fixed 
just to take it off the rent, which I'm like, that's cool. And that's what I want. I want a handyman. I, I, you know, that's what I was saying. And you, who, I don't know. I know some of you were in the live stream where I was saying, I want to find a handyman. Um, yeah, it is sad that he's being mean to the dog, but hopefully, obviously he's not gonna have that problem much longer. So I said to him, yeah, absolutely. And yeah, he's totally awesome. And I'm excited. And I didn't have to look far for a roommate. Thank I God. I found them, Stacey. I found these that was in my bag. Huh. There must be a bag. Oh, there probably is. Don't worry about it. Don't worry. Don't, don't fuss over it. It's somewhere. But, um, yeah. I'm excited to have a roommate and he's going to fix everything. So that's even more exciting. And his little dog will be safe here. So he'll be moving in soon and I'm excited. Yeah. And he's going to paint the whole downstairs and everything. So I'm excited, 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 excited. So that's good news. That's one less thing on my list I don't have to deal with. Well, actually two things. I don't have to list, deal with finding a handyman to do things. And I don't have to deal with finding a roommate. <laughs> oh, thanks, Jamie. Because that was stressing me out because I kept thinking, oh, you know, I don't want to. I really would like somebody that's not like a lazy piece of garbage who's, you know, going to like make things worse in my life. You know what I mean? I wanted somebody, I, I, I mean, I know I've said it in the, in the live streams before that, oh, it would be great if I could find somebody who's really handy, you know, and well, I did. So I'm very happy about that. So I was not going to not jump on that. He's like, don't worry. Anytime you need anything done, just let me know. I don't have a problem doing anything, you know. He's like, I like to keep, keep busy. Well, he, I mean, he has to keep his dogs downstairs because Tigger, it's a boy dog. So Tigger will never appreciate that. Tigger will just nonstop fight and cause problems. So he has to keep the dog downstairs, you know, which is fine because I mean, it, it'll be his apartment down there pretty much. And if he comes up, it'll only be to go to the bathroom, use the bathroom. He'll have his own bathroom, like the hall bathroom, but it's upstairs. And then he used part of the kitchen, but he's like, well, you know, he's like, I'm not, I don't cook that much. I'm like, neither do I. So, you know, and he'll have a refrigerator downstairs for himself. So it'll be awesome. And he works a lot. So obviously he's got his business that he does and he does everything. He does like everything. And he's not bad to look at either. So I'm not going to complain. <laughs> Yes, I have outside stairs, but the, you know, the garage is, he'll have the garage, um, he, he can go in and out through the garage and I can go, you know, it, I can go in and out up here. So it's not a big deal. All right, good. Oh, yeah. yeah, he is good looking. <laughs> <laughs> but yep, I'm excited about that. <coughs> oh, then stop chewing the gum, Kennedy. <laughs> <laughs> why do i need to give him a trial period i just need him to do what he needs to do he just needs to do his work huh yeah and he's got a good rating he wouldn't have a five-star rating because people around here are picky ass so he wouldn't have a five-star rating well he's coming on thursday uh he's coming thursday morning to start working around the house um so he's just gonna move in whenever since i don't have to prepare anything because he said don't worry about painting don't worry about you know whatever so i just need to go get the ceiling tiles for downstairs to replace a few of them well he's gonna do that he you know i told him i'd get the ceiling tiles and um 
because I have acoustic ceiling tile drop ceiling down there. So, and some of them are like stained a little bit from like condensation leaks or whatever. So I'm going to replace those. And then, you know, he's, he's going to paint. He's like, I'll just paint myself. You don't have to, you know, you know, buy the paint. I'll do that myself because, you know, that's not a big deal. So he's going to paint and stuff like that. Um, okay, Kennedy. Kellyanne, we went to the creative reuse. Yeah. To the creative reuse where I always go. We also stopped at Joanne's and grabbed something out of the clearance to work on. <laughs> did you even read the tag? I told him we was going to mix the media. Oh, mix the media? <laughs> yeah, we're going to mix the media, all right. That's funny. <laughs> mix the media. I want to put that tag on something. Yeah, that's cool. We're going to mix the media. I'm fine, Cheryl. Don't you worry about me. <laughs> I've been around the block a few times. I'll be all right. Dang it. Get off of there. I need to heat this up anyway. That's right. Believe me, anything is a upgrade from Chris. <laughs> Although he was helpful today. Yeah, he was. He was helpful. That's because you were here. <laughs> he I don't care. At least he was helpful. That's right. I'll give him the one, two, three. <laughs> Ugh, no. Crafty kitty. Oh, no, no. I'm way past that point in life. <laughs> That's not possible. Angel, did your blender work after you got it home? The sleep with pepper spray. That's what I need is a, is a blender from the, the I got to stop at the um, thrift store and get myself a blender too because I have that paper making kit and that was the only thing that was stopping me was the fact that I needed like something to blend it up with. Oh really? Yeah. I need to go and get myself like a blender. Yeah, but the problem is, is if you can't get Good pregnant, deal. then you can't, it doesn't matter what age you are. <laughs> <laughs> my my lady parts don't work anymore well they never really work so uh, they don't work why you think i ain't got no kids anyway kennedy said guess what what kennedy i figure if we trace the outside and then cut a little bit in we could probably get a piece of paper if we wanted to i don't know if i want to put paper on it or just paint it what do you think i don't know what were you thinking i had no idea hmm I maybe follow your lead <laughs> oh then if it turns out no good then it's gonna be my fault hmm Look. or ooh, you know what i, no, I can stand up oh that's cute oh i like it stood up yeah. i'm thinking i can hang it on my wall in the other room you can use it for a magnet, little magnet thing. Yeah, little magnet. Here, stick to it. Oh, yeah. Oh, see, that looks cute on there. Well, what I was thinking is I can do mine all, like, pink and pretty. And, like, maybe put pink little crafts in the center of it. Oh, that'd be cute. And have it in there as my, like... Yeah, we got... We got um a big part of my room cleared out my guest room so that and we put all the etsy stuff in there so it's no longer in here because <laughs> now i was able to move these carts back a little bit and now have it's fully some, creative 
reuse. <laughs> yeah, now, yeah, now, oh God, yeah, but that's okay because that I don't It'll mind. Be going in there too. Yeah, most of that's going to go in there anyway because we're going to, well, I'm going to start sorting it at some point and get, get a lot of fabric little packs up on Etsy. On Etsy. Nope, no kids. I don't know, Kennedy. Oh, I she got hurt yesterday at Sky Zone and thinks her foot's fractured. Oh, wonderful. Better go have it checked. Yeah. X-ray. Not that they can do much for it anyway for a fracture on a foot, but at no, least but... you'll know not to make it worse. Right. Can't use it as usual. <laughs> you need it. Oh, oh, now she needs it. <laughs> Foot's okay, but not fingers. <laughs> so I'm thinking that if I paint the whole thing and then distress it so you see some of the metal coming through. Yeah. I think good. that would be cool. And then add some paper, maybe some pink paper on the inside. And mostly just paint the outside edges. I want to do mine for Hannah. Oh, that's she's right. She's got them other stars in it. And it what what colors are hers? Her stars look just like this. Oh, they but do. Different sizes. Oh, if I remember correctly, or it's them other kind of stars. You mean for the baby? She had these in her kitchen or living room. Oh, it was them. Um, shoot, you know that jewelry we was looking at. You called it something. The cowboy stuff. Oh, oh, Southwest type Yeah, of? those are Southwestern oh, stars. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Huh. I thought that would look cute with them. What about the decorated? Are they done like the teal and the. She's brown and turquoise or teal or whatever. Yeah, probably what turquoise. Her colors was. Yeah, so I would say to color it, paint it, and then with the turquoise, and then rub. I would paint the whole thing in turquoise and rub some of the areas and distress it out mm -hmm. like we'll take some you know take some sandpaper and kind of rub it and distress it and then you can put like we could print something out and decoupage it on maybe or did you want to because i don't think i have southwest paper that would go on it like any kind of pattern paper but we could probably print something to like put in the middle yeah that would be cute you can even put her name maybe does she like things with her name on it, or is she one of those people that's like, oh, I don't like things monogrammed or whatever? Some people hate that. Yeah. I, um, I, I'm I like in the middle of that. Like, I like my name on some things, and then I don't. I figure something western because she's a cowgirl. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, you know what? Like a boot would look cute. Like a cute yeah. cowboy boot. We could print something out and glue it on to the center. Yeah. That would be cute. I'm trying to think if I have anything. That would we could put a baby boot beside it too. Oh the, the mama boot and the baby yeah. boot. <laughs> yeah. That we do. That would be so cute. I could find one online for sure. Cause I could just print one and then print one smaller. Yeah. That would be cute. That would be cute. Because then regardless whether it's a boy or girl, it doesn't have to be pink. It could just be a cowboy boot. Right. Like a big one and a little one. That would be cute. Good night, Angela. Good night, Angela. Use those wood wallpaper scraps. Wood wallpaper scraps. Oh, the wallpaper books. Use the wood ones. Oh, that would be cute on the background. I don't know if it would show up very well. Like it would, it's, these are so small and that pattern was so big. I think she should do it a little more with the turquoise. I think the wood is a little. Cheryl I, said alcohol inks on the stars. Uh, I don't think it would look right with this kind of patina look on there. I don't think it would look that great. I think the paint and the distress is more southwest than the yeah. alcohol ink would make it look a little weird. On this type of metal, I've done it before on this type of light. We could if even, it was a real smooth, shiny metal, but because it's that kind of, what do they call this? Like, it's like a oxidized metal or whatever. Yeah. I think paint would be the best. Paint and distress. Um, Take some like chocolate brown or something and dry brush it and stuff. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That would be great, too. Oh, yeah, hell yeah. Yeah, I think that would look great. So I'll be doing mine in pink, shabby chic-ish, and yours in that. That's a good All idea. Right. Good idea. Okay, let me 
kind of thing. So turquoise is usually the color. Not as is it teal that she likes or turquoise? Because one's a little more green. Usually turquoise is what is southwest. Yeah, I think it's the turquoise that she had in her color. It's a little bit like greenier than. They're tin. These are tin, right? Mm -hmm. Are they aluminum? I think they're tin. Yeah, they're like a tin. Yeah. Turquoise. Oh, cool. I, I knew I got that for some reason today. Yeah. I'm trying to think of what pink I want to use. I think I looked for that in the metallic, didn't I? I don't think I found it, though. Oh, really? I found it, didn't I? And I pointed it out to you. I don't know. I was looking for because the pink. Because I have it right here. And I had it. Oh, cool. I mean, I don't little... think I didn't find it. Huh. Well, that sucks. Yeah. That's all right. I'm trying to think what pink I want to use. I'm thinking crafty. Um, Stacy's making hers for her room. I'm making mine for my daughter. We just found out yesterday she's going to have a baby. You don't have a baby. That was my Mother's Day present. Yeah, I'm going to make this for my Etsy room. Because I need something pink on the walls in there. The walls are tan. And it's just plain, and I need to I need to fancy it up. I need to make it a little fancier. Has to decorate that brush. room. Yeah, that room's plain because it was going to just be a guest room, and then, well, you want this brush? Is that good? Oh, that'd be fine. Whatever. Whatever you think. Uh, whatever. I don't know. You. I don't know. <laughs> I'm easy. Just whatever. Cover it. Start by throwing some on there and painting it up. Thank you, Mary. I'm probably going to put paper in the middle. I don't know why I did that. Well, maybe not. I don't know. Maybe well, I will. Still... Oh, no. I think I was going to do... I don't know. I'm just going to paint it. Yeah. Screw it. You can paint it. Paint it and see what happens. Paint it and see what I feel like doing. I don't want to do that. No, you can do it. it. Yeah. You, it, it's easier not to gesso this because... Though gesso, if we go to distress it, is good for if you want to see a little bit of that white. Yeah. But if you don't and you want to just get to the metal, which I do, then it's better to just not and just put a couple layers of the paint on. All right. Am I doing the whole thing? Even the outside? Yeah, you do the outside edge. You know, it would be cool if we had some rope would go around this. Oh, that'd be cute. But I didn't see any there. And I don't think I have anything. Um, who was it? Angel? Was, uh... It's Nani, Janie. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you say, Grandma? Yeah, Pawnee <laughs> Grandma. <laughs> Uh-oh, don't call her Grandma. Hannah done had a shirt made that says Nani. <laughs> Nani. Never heard that one before. Thank you, Cheryl. I've heard Nana. My grandma was Nana, right? So all my... Well, she died when I was, like... Uh, was I five? Something like that. I loved her, my Nana. Yeah. But I didn't know she was my grandma. I Aww. thought she, she was my Nana. And I didn't know that that meant grandma. So everybody else, all the other kids I knew, oh, my grandma and grandma. I was like, oh, I don't have a grandma. And they were like, oh. And, and, and then I'd see, like, my Nana. And so I didn't know she was my grandma. And I was kind of sad about that because then she was the only grandma that I had that when I was, when, that was alive when I was born, they all died because my mom was older when she had me. So I didn't have any other grandparents. That was it. That's the only one I ever met. And to, to, and I didn't know until I was 12 or 13 years old that she was my grandma. I thought she was just Aww. my Nana. I didn't know that meant grandma. And my mom's yeah. like, I kept saying, oh, I wish I had grandparents. Well, you had your Nana. And I'm like, well, that, that wasn't my grandparent. And she's like, yes, it was. That's what Nana means. And I'm like, oh, had no idea. Because all my other friends called their grandma and grandpa, you know, like yeah. I was the only one that called her Nana. I don't know. 
so I didn't know. So I was like sad that I didn't like know that for some reason. It made me like, oh damn, I didn't know my, I didn't, I don't feel like I don't know my, didn't know my grandma because I didn't know she was my grandma. <laughs> But she was awesome. She would give me candy. And it's funny because she's my dad's mom. And my dad's an ass. And the <laughs> fact that his mom was so cool and so nice and would always give us candy and, like, be nice to us and was never mean to us. I was like, oh, where the hell did he come from? Because he certainly didn't skip the dinner. Seem, yeah, <laughs> something. I don't know. What the heck? Whoops, that's going to be noisy all night on the craft. Thank you, Carla. Matt thing. Yes, and we're going to make her, I'm going to help her make her um, daughter's uh, baby, shower. baby shower. So that we're going to decorate it all good. Because I do good stuff like that. And I'll make like, I can make like cool baby shower favors. Ooh. And all kinds of like chocolate with little, I still have my molds. I probably still have it. But we can do like, I can make a banner and we can do all kinds of things. You can come over like, uh, you know, like a month. We'll start planning it like um, two months before. Yeah. And we'll like get all, make all the decorations by hand and it'll be fun. I love doing stuff like that. I did my friend's baby shower. We're I, I told her we're going to make diaper cakes. I'll show her how to make diaper cakes because I used to make diaper cakes and I still have some of the stuff. Um, diaper cakes and it's going to be, we can make cool shaped. I can make any shape diaper cake you want. You want a diaper cake make that looks like a Corvette? I can make you a diaper cake that make, looks like a Corvette. Like a horse. A horse? <laughs> yeah. I bet we can do like a horse head type of thing or a horse. But it being for the baby, she may not want it, you know. Yeah, see, find out what her theme is right. idea are for her room. That's what you'll end at her room. I'm saying her like it's a girl. For its <laughs> room. <laughs> now watch, it's going to be a girl now that I did that. Um, find out what the theme is going to be for the kid's room. And then you go with that and decorate the baby shower that way. Because she'll know that. But the baby shower is usually not till they're seven or eight months old. Eight months pregnant, I mean. So... Kellyanne says she can't shop at their creative reuse unless she's a teacher. Oh, yeah. Some of them are like that. They were so happy we were getting so much stuff. They were like, yes, please clean us out. Because I guess <laughs> they have a lot and they keep getting, you know, they have so much that they were just excited that we were taking it. All right. My first. Are you doing your back too? No, probably not the back. You can if you want, but. I'll let this dry before I. Oh, I need to clean my paint out. I need to clean my paint bucket. It's oh, good. yeah. I mean, there's enough clean water that. over here for this brush, but it's got gnats floating in it. That's not good. We don't need gnats on our project. No. That's not good at all. Let me go dump this. No, clean it. Sing the song. Tell Pauline she needs to sing you a song. Oh, that's cool, Cheryl. <laughs> Amur. I think that's sweet, Tammy. Thanks, Anita. I think it needs another coat when that one dries because it's just rubbing off. There's no water. Okay, 
Hi, Teresa. You were sick. What's wrong? Oh, I'm sorry, Teresa. I hope you feel better. Hello. <laughs> You guys see my new craft mat? <laughs> it's a piece of glass. <laughs> For those who were not here, I'm going to be canceling my order. Yeah, I'm going to be canceling my order for the other one because, um, yeah, this will work. Yep. I don't need it. I'm so annoyed. So. I just forget it. <laughs> yeah. That's just ridiculous. I mean, I'm not really annoyed. I mean, like, I don't care about waiting that much, but. At this point, I thought about, like, I weighed the cons and the pros, and I was like, this is fine. I don't care whether there's measuring grids on it. I have this one for measuring grids if I need it. And I'm going to leave them right next to each other because this one and this one are, like, the same thickness. And I'll just put them right next to right. each other and have these two pieces of glass for now because I'm actually going to get myself, take the money that I got from the Tim Holtz mat and use that towards the glass top for my desk and do my desk and take it outside and maybe my new handyman roommate will help me <laughs> and know how to like know the best way to go yeah, about painting that up this for me. that's true well he doesn't have to build it all i have to do is Mom put the door on it. he'll put probably it he'll and... probably know a good place to get the damn glass you probably have a discount too yeah so yeah he has a guy that works for him too so the guy that works for him is going to come help do the deck and stuff he's like i'm going to do the deck and we're going to get rid of that hot tub we're going to make your deck out there usable and blah 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 i was like good because i need it i need to use it utilize my deck out there every now and again even though i have crap in front of the door but oh that's a good idea anita glass out of an old microwave Oh yeah, that'll work too. But yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna find out about that, and I'm probably gonna get working on that piece of that door in the next like week or two. I'm gonna get a can, a couple cans of spray paint, and I'm gonna seal up all the windows on it with some tape, and then I'm gonna go. I want to spray paint it and not paint it. Yeah, like just get a paint spray paint that I like. Yeah, that would. And good. then if I want to do any kind of like texture work on it or any kind of anything else I can do that but it would just be easier to spray paint something that big instead of right. brush and everything just take spray you know the yeah, underneath doesn't mark. need to be done just the one side right. yeah I won't have brush marks either and then I could stencil on the flat parts if I want to and make it look kind of funky and then seal it all with a good sealer a couple coats of sealer and and then all I need to do is you know Put the cabinet underneath each side and it's done. And the lights on it and the glass. I hope you feel better, Mia. Oh, hi, Mia. Everybody's sick today. That's not good. Cute. Look Missed that. your video, Teresa. See the speckles on it? Oh, yeah. Isn't that weird? That's cool looking, actually. It I, is. I like it. I'll have to watch it later. Whose video what? Teresa. She had a, some kind of a haul video or something. Oh. Something. I don't know. I just saw it. I don't remember the name of it. Oh, mine's coming off. <laughs> what is? My paint. Oh, is it? Yeah, when I touch it. We'll probably have to seal it after we paint it. I have sealant. Give it a little seal. Because it is metal, so if you yeah. rub too much, it might. I guess we'll have this to... ain't dry enough in these spots. What we'll do is where we go to, whenever we rub it off, after. Yeah. Um, And then I'll, I'll take it out on the deck and seal it. I'll spray it with the mat, um, the mat spray. That'll that'll help that problem. 
it just needs to be sprayed because it's metal and metal does not like things sticking to it but it'll distress real easily which is nice yeah i might need three coats on this actually pink is kind of thin A pretty color. Mm -hmm. This is the perfect color for it. It was up there, something. Oh. Let me scroll up. Oh, let me scroll. Something else. Where'd it go? What were you looking for? I'm oh, sorry, where it was. I don't know. When you walk oh, I missed what did you do Teresa yeah we lost what you did something about something looks something, like Christmas yeah something about Christmas you'll have to holler at us because we can't hear you all the time We can't hear them at all. <laughs> you said that the last time too, I think. And it wasn't it you that said it during I think it was when was that, New Year's Eve or something? You said something about we can't we can't hear you or I don't remember what it was. It was just, me and me and what's her name both said, I don't think they can ever hear they can never hear we can never hear them or whatever it was. I don't know, it was something funny to that effect. Made us I got all a huge fun at the swamp what swamp meat swamp meat not swamp swamp <laughs> swamp meat <laughs> what was the swamp meat we swapped meat yeah where was it at they were swapping meat i got a huge find at the, the swap meat yeah what you get? What was your find? Yeah, what ought you get? I was just reading it the way you wrote it. I knew what you meant. <laughs> yeah. And Tracy, what, what do you remember? What the, where the poppy paper was from? Uh, autumn leaves or something. Yeah, it was autumn leaves or something, Tracy. And it was called poppy something or other. Poppy paradise, poppy something. Oh yeah, thanks, uh, Karen. My links are in the description, and a lot of people say to me, "Oh, I get messages constantly of people saying, I don't see your Etsy link. Your Etsy, you should put your Etsy link." Um, I have to show you guys because apparently I don't know what it is, but people they don't know this, and I don't know how they don't know this, but I mean, because Etsy's been around a lot. I mean, YouTube's been around at like a long time and people don't know how to get to this description box or something i don't know what it is but it's like I, one lady she's like you should put your etsy link in every video i said it is in every video it's automatically in there uh, and i had to like let i had to like tell her where to go i'm just like confused at how people don't know this but um clearly there are people that don't and i'm going to show you guys real quick in case you're one of them that has no clue about this um little trick but i'm going to show you. turn back on dummy oops there we go cool Teresa. 
Um, let's see, where is it? Go here, go here. Um. Okay. Here's my screen. Okay. And pretend this is a video live stream. It doesn't matter, right? You scroll down. Oh, this one's open already. Ugh. I'm trying to show one of the ones that's not. Let me see. Let's do this. I'll show you on a video because it's not showing up on that. Okay, let's do this one from last night. Let me just. Okay, so any video, live stream, whatever, if you scroll underneath, here's the description box. See this little thing that says show more? You click it, and there it is Etsy, Patreon, my, aunt, my Blitzy. I have a Blitzy affiliate link as well. If you buy anything off of Blitzy, click on this link first, and it'll. I'm a Blitzy affiliate. I'm also an Amazon affiliate. If you click on this link and start shopping on Amazon, it, it gives me a little bit of money. Um, my Facebook group is right here. My Twitter is right here. And, you know. And if you like my intro, you can get your own intro right here from this link. Like, all kinds of links are under here. But you have to hit show more. And I even say it right in the top. I, I put it right here so that when it says um, show less, at least the first thing is click show more to see all my inks and off. And this woman still said to me, your Etsy link, it's like, I don't know. But anyway, that's what you click, show more. And there it is. Everything's there. And it's under the video that you're watching right now. So the live stream, it's there. It's there. It's there. It's there. Always. It's automatically there. All the time. But some people just don't see it. They're just like, what? Yeah, on phones, there's a little arrow. Yeah. But, I mean, I don't know. I don't get it. I don't either. <laughs> or that some people don't. Yeah. Not them, but. <laughs> they do show up in blue you just have to click show more to see them but they show up in blue I don't know if you're on a phone or something and they don't show up there but they're there can I have a baby wipe yes ma'am thank you ma'am thank you I was so lucky to find this piece of tempered glass we were looking at a piece of um marble yeah or not marble granite great yeah and i was That's like right. mm, yeah and then it was a little thick and then we walked around the other side and there it was i was like oh perfect it's rounded edges it's tempered glass i was like hell yeah you can tell tempered glass most of the time because it's blue here when you look at it from the side yeah you see that blue that's not from the mat that's from the tempered glass I was so excited. I don't, this might have been out of a fridge or something somewhere. It looks like somebody hand ground down these two corners. Right. Or these corners, maybe. Because the way they look, they kind of look hand done. Like somebody must have had it for something and then took it and. At least did they're it. rounded. Yeah. They're not sharp. Yeah, they're not sharp at all. I'm excited. I could put a pink piece of pretty something underneath of it if I want to, but honestly, I'm going to get my glass soon anyway, so I'll be using this. Can they see? Can they? Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I left it there. Whoops. You guys don't Oops. need to see yourselves. <laughs> sorry. Oh, and you know what I can do? I didn't have this twisted either so that you could see. What am I doing? I'm trying to move that. That's cool, bit. Teresa. And so you could see her. We'll figure it out. You got a very old distress kit from uh, mem We Are Memory Keepers. When you say distress kit, what, what is in it? What's all in it?
a pumice stone um, rub and tool. Uh, so you got a pumice stone. Is that for like, I know what a pumice stone is for, but what are they, what, what would, what are they wanting you to dis distress with a pumice stone? Wood or glass or something? Well, it's just a kit. Well, right. It's a kit, but what's in it? Like, like, what do they want you to stress with it? The pumice stone is meant for, like, you can use a pumice stone on your heels to make them softer. You scrub it. It's like a scrub. You can actually scrub rust oh, yeah. off of things with it. But I'm wondering what they're wanting you to distress with it. If it's from We Are Memory keeper Keepers. Huh. Oh, you showed it in a video? Steel wool and some spongy stuff? Huh. Huh. Guess yeah, I that sounds like look. you would do, like, metal or glass or wood or something. Huh. Interesting. Yeah, some pictures. It's that sparkle and pop. Yeah. <laughs> Are you cold? <laughs> Do you have a sweater? I brought my little jacket. Oh, can you give me a sweater or something? I'll give you a sweater. Do your arms are cold. <laughs> I'm probably warm. Do, am I, do I, my arms feel warm? Yeah. Yeah, see, I'm always warm. <laughs> You're one of those people that's always cold and I'm always warm. Yeah. I think it's time for some cherry pie. I was just sitting here thinking about that pie. <laughs> uh, I think I want to go get some pie. I'll be right back. Uh-oh. We're going to have some cherry pie, folks. So you're going to get Would y'all like some? We'll bring you some, but you can't really have it. <laughs> you're not allowed to have it. Mine. Oh, my. Don't hit that. Oh. Cherry pie. Oh, it's water. Man, we are working on these stars. Stacy's going to decorate hers for her craft room, and I'm going to decorate mine for my daughter. I just found out I'm going to be a grandmother tomorrow, uh, yesterday. My daughter is a cowgirl. She was training for barrel racing, but now she has to put that on hold for a little while. Okay, Teresa. Wrap the edges of paper works pretty good. Karen, Karen bought this is Stacy's, and I'm Pauline, and this one's mine. Thank you, Mia. Yeah, Angela, cherry pie with ice cream. Hi, Karen. So what are you ladies doing? Anybody crafting?
Yes, Whitehead is correct. Cool, Mary Jane. What are you going to craft, Teresa? The light side of the star, Mia. Hi, Renee. Stacy went to go get cherry pie. She'll be back in a minute. <laughs> Good luck with that, Angel. Me and Janie have a hard time keeping our workstation clean. Oh, good night, Mary. Sweet dreams. I think we need to do the back if they're going to stand up. What do y'all think? If we stand these up like on a table instead of hanging them, shouldn't we do the back? Thank you, Mary. You have a good night. I don't look like much of cherry pie. It's Sunday <laughs> right now. Yay. It's like a Sunday with whipped cream. I asked everybody, Stacy, but nobody. Uh, oh, want Kelly oh, and did. Oh, for me. See, look at that. Teresa said yes. That is some If we're going to stand these up, yeah. shouldn't we do the back? Oh, I was going to hang mine. But oh, you, are you? If you're going to stand yours. Oh, well, I, I don't you know how we can there. handle do it, but. No, I would paint it then. Let's see. Here's mm. our pie with mm -hmm. ice cream. Mm -hmm. Yummy, yummy. I had to heat it up a little bit because we waited two hours and it cooled yeah. down. Mm. Ooh, that's yummy. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You want to try? <laughs> no, nah, they don't need it. All for us. Mm-hmm. No crafting, Cheryl? Why no crafting? Mm. It is yummy, Teresa. Mm, it's melty, yummy goodness. Mm-hmm. Oh my goodness. Mm. <laughs> You're at work from 6 30 p.m. to 6 30 a.m. Yuck. You know, there's a good chunk of ice cream in there. A lot of whipped mm -hmm. cream you saw on top, but. Hey, we're special. We have whipped cream and ice cream. Mm -hmm. I have all the goodies at my house. <laughs> <laughs> mm. 
this is where you come if you have a sweet tooth for right now anyway thanks to my prednisone <laughs> There's not enough ice cream, I don't think, because I don't have enough pie to ice cream ratio. I might have to put more on. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta have cream with your pie. Whipped cream and ice cream. Not just one or the other. Yes, Angela, these are metal. They're heavy metal. Mmm. Yummy. That's really good. We're going to be on a sugar high. <laughs> Keep us awake. I know it. That's right. Hi, Shelly. Poodle piglets. Yes, Karen, we picked it up today. I got it. Ooh, cheesecake. Yummy. That's another one of my favorites. Mm -hmm. That's what I wanted to make New Year's Eve along with the um, creme brulee, but I never ended up having time. Oh, yeah, you said you do yours homemade, don't you? Mm -hmm. Your cheesecake. Thank you, Karen. I did get my solution. Welcome back, Marlena. Yes, yeah, I, I ran, I'm running out of ice cream. <laughs> if you like New York style cheesecake, I make the best in New York style cheesecake. Well, for now it's going to there. I ate the whole thing. And I got my pina colada. Hi, Renee. Can't help buffering, unfortunately. Nothing I can do about that at this point. Now, Angela, we painted it's them. It's going to have to happen with a brush. Yeah. I can't open this. That's great. Not good for arthritis. No You're no better than me. <laughs> well, you might have loosened it for me. <laughs> mm. Isn't that hard? The hell. Oh, Jesus, you got it. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Oh, you're talking about, uh, what do you call it? What's the name of that place with the frozen yogurt and the, the cheesecake squares and the strawberries? Oh, yeah. Sweet CC's, that's it. I used to love sweet CC's because you can go there and do that and get the, oh, put as much toppings as you want on. Yeah, I made the creme brulee for New, New Year's Eve. We did that. Yeah, that was good. Well, oil paint's really, I mean, you paint with it on canvas and stuff like that. 
you can't mix like oil and acrylic so you can't do anything you know you know with that you can't use it with mixed medium uh not really because oil paint takes forever to dry and you can't like really speed it along with a heat gun very much you kind of just have to let it dry for like a day so the best thing to do with oil paints is to paint with them because you can you know learn some techniques and do some canvas painting with them you want pie yeah i only make the creme brulee for special occasions But yeah, that's a good gift, Marlena. Mm. Oof, that hit my stomach like a rock. Yeah, I'm probably going to hang mine. She probably would too with her other stars. Yeah. I was just wondering. Man, well, I mean, you can always do the back just in case she doesn't. Good night, Elite Anita. Good night. Go let the dogs out. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I have my torch for both acrylic pouring and creme brulee. <laughs> Yeah, and creme brulee or cheesecake is my favorite dessert, but most of the time they don't get the cheesecake right when I go somewhere to a restaurant. Creme brulee, you know, it's it's a crapshoot, but a lot of times they do get it okay. It's you know, it's fine. But cheesecake, for some reason, when they make New York style cheesecake, everybody screws that up. And especially down here, they think they know what New York style cheesecake is, but clearly they don't. Vanilla with poppy seeds? Hmm. Well, all, well, most all creme brulee is vanilla with, with vanilla beans in it, not yeah. poppy seeds. I've never heard of poppy seeds with it. That's interesting. Yeah, you oh. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you. You don't run in the creme B circle? <laughs> oh, I do. That sounds good, Marlena. Mmm. Second was lemon. Yeah, I've 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 heard of the lemon creme brulee, but not the not with poppy seeds. That sounds interesting. Happy Mother's Day, everybody. My kids didn't get me a card, nothing. They just peed all over the floor and pooped. That's what I got for Mother's Day. So did it still have the vanilla beans in it? The vanilla bean seeds in it? Because usually the vanilla bean seeds are at the bottom of creme brulee. So were they still in there? When my kids were little, I'd 
bought that vanilla ice cream with the beans in it and they flatly refused to eat it because they thought it was bugs. <laughs> oh god. And they would not eat it with the vanilla beans. Oh yeah, napkin. <clears throat> Miss Pauline brought me some pretty napkins. Look at those. They look very boho y. Happy Mother's Day, mothers. I had poppy seeds instead. Oh, that's crazy. Huh. I want that. I want to try it. Mm hmm. So it so it didn't have vanilla beans in it at all. Peepee that's bed. cool. Oh. What? <laughs> what? Shelly put. They tried to spell Happy Mother's Day. Yeah, out. they they. <laughs> oh. Well, Marlena, yeah, their best pee and poop just for Mother's Day. Yeah, exactly. That's what they did. Came home and Willow had missed her pee pad and peed on the <laughs> on the floor. I was like, ah, oh, good lord, woman, get on the pee pad when you got to pee. But they were cute today. They were being good. Happy Mother's Day. That's right, Pauline. That yeah, you you got to meet them for the first time today. Yes, they're so sweet. They just loved her. Anytime she they sat down, so they were like magnets cute. on her. Kissing her and licking her. And... <laughs> yeah, I guess that's all they had to give. That's true. That's their present to me was, oh, look, Mommy. I peed on the floor for you. <laughs> Start by smoking you. Yeah. You sure? Yeah. I have that ashtray that's out there. I think it's full of water right now. Don't worry. You know what? Use this. It's glass. There you go. Have at it. What's her name? I'll smoke it in here. I don't care. Tidy. All right, so what are we going to do? I think you're dry. Uh, is yours done? I said I need to do another coat because I can still see through to mine. And that probably Mine's because pretty covered. Yeah, yours looks covered. Yeah, yours looks covered. Mine is not because it's a light paint, I guess. Yeah. Oh, that hurt my stomach. I ate too much of that. Whoa. Yeah, but and um, on top of it, I'm tired. <laughs> well, my lips got chapped today. Who's? Mine. It did? Yeah, and I give all my chapstick to my daughter. And I don't uh, have any in my purse. I have some that you just put your finger in and do it. So mm -hmm. my it's never been like on my mouth. If you want some of that. Yeah, if you don't mind, because they should be mine. No, I'll get it in a second. Yeah, just no hurry. Yeah, it's like in a little tin, and you just take your finger and yeah. I don't use it that much, so it's not really been used very it's much. It's like the wind was blowing that much today. <laughs> Probably because I had the air conditioning cranking <laughs> on your lip. Could have been. <laughs> I forgot about that. Little Carmex. Oh, Carmex, thanks. Got a unicorn. Yeah, that's the one that Janet had given me for Skinny my dipping. Christmas or my birthday. She put it in my package and it had a little unicorn on it. Luckily, I never really had an issue with chap lips, but I do have an issue with my lips getting semi-dry, but not chapped. Just yeah. They just feel a little drier than they used to, but you know what the best thing for chap lips is? Aquaphor. Oh, yeah. You know what that is, right? A lot of people use it for babies' bottoms because it's good for their, you know, to keep diaper rash away, but yeah. it's that, and it's great. It has no taste or no flavor. It's just, it's just like putting a lip balm on. on. Yeah. It doesn't have any flavor, but I swear by it because um, I had, like, I was having some dry lip, not really chapped, but dry lip, and I put that on, and, like, in a day, my lips were so soft, and I was like, well, damn. So my friend, she had really bad chap lips. And I'm like, she was like, oh, I don't have a chapstick or I don't have 
something. And I had this tiny thing of aquaphor. I had a bigger one at home, but I had a tiny one in my purse because we were out somewhere. And I said, here, put this on your lips. It worked for me. I don't know. You know, it'll probably work for you. And I let her keep it. And she called me like the next day and she goes, that stuff made my chapped lips like go away in 24 hours. They were wow. just gone. She was like, I kept putting it on. And like the next morning I did not have chapped lips anymore. And so another friend I had mentioned to her, you should try Aquaphor. And she did it when her lips, lips were chapped. She goes, oh my God, that works so good. I don't know how, but Aquaphor is great for chapped lips. Apparently <laughs> it's good. I know it was good for my dry, you know, a little bit of dry lip that I had. Um, so, but it, I, you know, it works for chap lips really well, but I think I've had like, a f I don't think I've ever had like chap chap lips, but I think I had like a, uh, like a little bit of a thing when I was younger. I remember something about my mom giving me something because my lips were bothering me, but it wasn't like super chapped. I just remember I had. A little bit of an issue. I think it was because it was winter time and I was skiing a lot then. But as far as like some people get like really bad chap lips. Yeah. And uh, this the first girl, she <clears throat> always had chap lips. She was always talking about how she had chap lips, chap lips. And I gave her that. She's like, oh my God, Aquaphor changed my life. <laughs> I was like, well, that's good then. Thank you, Angel. Tracy said Aquaphor is awesome. Yeah. Well, I, I love it for my hands and stuff in the winter when everything's getting dry. I just lost. I had a big bop, tube of it. I can't find it. Thank I you, have you. it somewhere. I just don't know what the hell I did with it. Chris has used, has used it on his lips, too. I forgot about that. When he was here and his lips were bothering him, maybe he's the one that has my Aquaphor. I don't know. Okay, I don't I Kennedy. It get it x-rayed. It's yeah, get that foot. It's hurting that care bad. Of. That's probably what's wrong with it. Or a bad sprain. A sprain usually hurts worse than a break or a fracture. Yeah. That's true because I've had a fractured wrist and it didn't hurt very much, <laughs> but yet I've had a sprained wrist and I was like, damn, that hurts. That's got to be broken. And I'd go and they'd be like, no, it's just sprained. But when I had a fractured wrist, it didn't really hurt. And I was like, didn't even go to the hospital right away. Cause I was just like, nah, it's fine. <laughs> I fell in the shower and broke my, I think it's my right foot again. And it hurt. I had to get up the middle night and go to the emergency mm. room myself and it was broke. So yeah, it was broke twice. Oh, <laughs> well, that's not good. Let us know how it turns out, Kennedy. Hopefully it's not broken. Hopefully it's just sprained. You don't need to start off the summer with a broken foot. No. No, no. They go good together. Mm. 
I don't know, Kennedy. I'm not sure. Probably not too terribly long, um, just because I think we're both exhausted. But don't worry about how long we're going to be on. Go get your damn foot looked at, crazy lady. <laughs> That's more important. All right. Oh, it's nice and hot. <laughs> Okie dokie. So what's next? Now we get to distress the distress it. it. Mm hmm. And then seal it after we distress it. We're going to have to distress it lightly so that we don't rip it apart too much. Right. Because it, it'll, come, it'll distress easily. So we'll probably just use the... Okay, Kellyanne. Either the fine or the extra fine. You see how much it actually will distress with the extra fine. Probably the corners. Let me try this one. Yeah, it's better. We'll do like corners, some of the edges. That's where it's going to distress the best. Yeah. The corners and the edges and stuff. And we're just going to have to clean it up because it's going to peel and we have to go around and do that and flake it off in the opposite direction. Sounds good, Tracy. Do some on yours. I'll let mine dry a little bit more. It's still a little wet. Light of your life, Kennedy, <laughs> to go to the hospital at 12 a.m. Mm -hmm. You get to go just when all the crazies are out. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's peeling off right there. That's all right. Just do this. Just go the opposite way, and it'll just kind of cut it off and let it be. You want it to be distressed, so. You know, that's actually a good look like that. Nice and worn on the corners. And then I have a good finish spray that I can take them outside and do with. I just need to find it. It's over here somewhere. Um, Either that or it's in my drawer. What about the, uh, the brown? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. After, yeah, we could do that before. Here it is. Just use this stuff here. We'll just do the brown on the inside, right? Yeah. Well, if we're going to do the brown, well, well, no, we could do it after. It's fine. I mean, we're just going to do a little dry brushing of it. You know, it's yeah, like we're going to water it down and dry brush it. I have an antiquing uh, stuff that would work. Oh, yeah, that'd be good. Yeah. 
Is that all you're doing? Yeah, it looks all right. You don't have to be in the middle at all? I don't know if we can get it down in the middle, can we? Oh, yeah. I could do it. Oh, okay. I like a good distress. Love that distressing. Just love it. stick so bad on there. I have a sandpaper too. That should be might be a little easier. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't want to do gesso because then you'd see the gesso. Yeah, I'd see the white. You'd see the white as you know, went through the layers and it would be harder to cover that up. You don't need to do it on something like this. Not if we're going to coat it after. Because this way we only see color and the metal underneath as we go through it. If we would have gessoed it, it would have been also makes it a little harder to to distress. Get some, get a good hole going there. Ooh, making a mess. I like this finally coming up. Yeah, no. Give me some elbow grease. Elbow grease. You know what? Maybe I'll use the thicker stuff, the harder, rougher stuff, a little bit coarser. Make this go by a little quicker. Mm -hmm. Why not? I'll try this one. Oh, Lord. Did you say you had like a patina or something? Yeah. Yep, I got well, you can turn your volume down. That's the best I can do for you. <laughs> you have the control of the volume, not me. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> not much we can do about that. Well, that all come off right there pretty good. <laughs> oh, that's good. Yeah, that's actually good. The more distressed, the more, you know, the more like random it looks, the better. Yeah, do it in like a circle and do it like this so that you that you take it off in a do it like this. It'll kind of come off a little more spotty. Are you using the same kind of paint? Um, no, probably not. 
Now I wish I was using that. This <laughs> <laughs> is a little easier to do, but the spot's being a little stubborn. Wow, well, like I put three coats on there. No, I put three coats. Yeah, but mine was oh, darker, cool. so. Look at me. Look at me. Distress. Love it. Love it. Love it. I get all the sides now. Is that somebody here? No. What the train? Is that a train? Yeah. Oh. You know what's funny? It's 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 literally across the street from Chris. Really? Is it, it his house? It's like <laughs> I'm like, good lord, because I was outside with him one day <laughs> trying to help him get the car battery to work or not uh, the tire pumped. Why well, I say car battery? I don't know. When we were getting the uh, the car tire pumped, and all of a sudden the train goes by, and I'm like, what the hell, Chris? <laughs> and he's like. He's like, I know that keeps me up every night. It keeps oh, going wow. by every night. I'm like, I'm well, in panic mode. <laughs> I said, I said, he says, I said, well, you'll get used to it. Yeah. After a I while, you won't notice panic it. Because this train here used to keep me up at night. And listen to how light that is. I was like, you'll get used to it. I'm like, but that's why I your rent is so cheap. I didn't having PTSD until my early Oh, 30s. I can imagine that you would bother you even more. It didn't Good hit me Lord. till my 30s, though. Oh, really? Well, if you'd ever heard it coming and you had no idea that it even ever happened, it, well, you know what I mean? Like, I can't imagine it would bother you that much, but then all of a sudden it did. All of a sudden in my 30s, wow. I would freak out if we got close to a railroad track. Oh I mean, God. I was in panic mode, you know. Oh, that's right. We went over it attacks. twice today. <laughs> well, you know, I when forgot we all about that. that street, there was a train going by when we got to the cross, oh. and that's why I double checked because we done saw the train right. there. So I was like, did the train yeah. just come through here? <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, don't blame me. That's the last thing we need to have happen is that again. <laughs> <laughs> that wouldn't be cool. No. That's all makes that noise every now and again. It must be something. All right, I got this everywhere. I got it on the floor. I got it everywhere. I probably do too. <laughs> All right. More of those baby wipes. If I do, I can just do this and see if it's down here so I don't get it. Or everything. I'm going to wipe this off now. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. So Maybe we'll wipe it off at night. Yeah, wipe it off and then I'll take it outside and do the. the all over me. Do you need to do the patina before or after? Um, oh, we could do it before. Him. That's right, I keep forgetting we're doing that. Brain fart. We can do it after the patina. I mean, what did I say before? No, after. Spray it after the yeah. patina. Yeah. Just so everything sticks good. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's going to be cute. I wonder if my daughter's been watching. <laughs> oh, that's right. Well, would she have chat, maybe? No? Probably not. No. She should text me and say that she had come on, but you don't ever know. Teresa, right. I got got lucky and found some at the Creative Reuse today. Some embossing powder. I found what three or four. Yeah. Do you have colors, or is it just a clear? I 
Let me get in the drawer over here so I can get that antique and cream. It's here, but what do you call it? It's in here somewhere, I think. Wait, is it? Or did I put it over here? No, I can take it. Well, no, it is in one of the smaller bottles. That's the gel stain. That is black. black. Teresa, did you have colors or just the oh. clear embossing? This is an English red oxide. We can check and see if we like this. If not, we can do one of the gel stains. I think I like a chocolate brown. Well, let's, yeah, let's try these. Let's see which one of these you like best. Because this one's a little on the redder side. Yeah. And then we got the gel stains, which. Oh, very similar, so this one will be the darkest one. So, we take that and just a tiny bit of water because it's already very translucent. And brush would be this one, probably. This one you can get an all over. You want to try it? See if you, you like can. it. You can. You to do it? Yeah. <laughs> You're like, you can. <laughs> and what we're going to do is rub it off. Oh, okay. Yeah, because if you just dry brush it, it's going to do like weird things. Whereas this, you can kind of get it on there and it's meant to like, like kind of wipe it off. Yeah. And then it'll get stuck in some of the areas. Like the darker area, like the, you know what I mean. Yeah. In there and clear it and just kind of make it look old. And give it that old look. Leave it in the corners. You want it to be in the corners so that it looks like. Which doesn't help. Oh, wow, one. Teresa. You did look up. She's got over 40 colors. Oh my god, that's a lot. <laughs> that's awesome. I'll get with you later, okay? <laughs> <laughs> what? On her Etsy store. Oh, oh, she's putting them in her Etsy? Yes. Yeah, cool. completely until like so you can work with it a little bit yeah and like keep rubbing it off or adding more and trying to get it to sit in the corners mostly but just give it like because that's where it'll look right the best and Make shadow it, it the best one. yeah something yours yeah i think i'm gonna just dress it as well i keep rubbing that off completely let me let that sit for a second <laughs> i keep like completely rubbing it off and you can and that's the thing like what i like about these is that 
these gel stains and stuff they don't dry until you let them sit Why does it do that on this suction here? It's like it doesn't Bring it up pain. I'll just do that and not mess with it too much. Well, that's good, Teresa. At least you found it today. center anyway even if it's not perfect it'll actually just dress around where we're going to put something so that's kind of good yeah and then the inch and inches if you want it darker at all because i can darken it more if you want it kind of a little more distressed yeah, maybe a little. Okay. I'll let that dry and go over it a little bit. That's all you gotta do is a couple layers. Yeah. Now we're good. Need more. Maybe try it like this without putting any water on it. Spanky. Hey, Spanky. Good night, Tracy. Thanks for coming. Good night, Tracy. That's better. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's showing up on the silver. Mm hmm. Both of our stomachs are going to burn. <laughs> Too much cherry pie. Too much cherry pie. <laughs> That's great, Spanky. She just did her first live stream. <gasps> Ooh, nice. And what did you do on your first live stream? Yeah, what did you make? Spanky. Was you nervous? <laughs> she said it was great. Awesome. That's good. Good, good. It's her and her roommate. Oh. You, oh, you have a roommate now? Did you, are your parents still there? They didn't. No, they played with jelly plate. They did homemade stencils. Or do you have a roommate and your parents are there? Oh, and her homemade. Oh, I'm do some more in the center. I'll just... nope. Since I'm not going to water it now, we're just going to darken it a little bit. Do these two corners. And then I'll move to the other ones. Parents moved out four weeks ago. She oh, was a new roommate. cool. Sweet. I bet you're happy about that to have your house back a little bit. Does that mean you got your craft room up and going again? I would imagine if you're doing live streams. Ooh, that looks cool. You like it? Mm -hmm.
We're getting all rustic on it. Looking good. Most of the craft room is done. She said I have a few bookcases to organize, but mostly done. Awesome. like it's rusted on it yeah in the corners it always looks cool I could do more on the outside I just rather start off white and yeah see what you like I'm just kind of tapping it with my rag just wiping it off a little bit so it stays in the corners real good that little spot right there. Yeah. Night, Kennedy. You haven't She's left at the, the hospital. hospital. Oh, she is now already? Yeah. How'd you get there so fast? You live across the street? <laughs> <laughs> Good Lord. I think that's why she's got to go because we're probably calling her to the bank, maybe. Mm -hmm. Good night, Holly. It's not that far from her house, she oh. said. Thanks, Holly. Have a good night. It's cool. I like this. This is looking really cool. Rustic and cool. Now we need a horseshoe to match it. Oh, yeah. A horseshoe's been good. Yeah. I got a little one about like that. Yeah. Or a horseshoe just stick in there. Yeah. Are they here? That damn dresser. Sounds like it. Uh, Sounds like it to me too. this would match and oh, yeah. i just realized i wish i would have picked up like four more and did like a star thing with yeah, these colors pretty. one in this color one in an orange like a dark orange color all rusticy, and one in like a yellow like a dark ochre yellow like a yellow yeah. ochre oh that'd so be pretty cool. that would have been cool for my living room well they're, if they're still on clearance maybe i'll go back and get some because this would be so awesome I could probably make these and sell a set of them in Etsy. Like sell a whole set of these in different colors together. Yeah. So excited. Hey, Digger. Hi, buddy. Tigger says, give me love. Hey, buddy. These girls get all the attention. I didn't know. Poor baby. 
He's spoiled Poor it all. Baby. He's so neglected. Alrighty. Looks like it's been sitting on the side of a barn for <laughs> 30 years. If you wanted this rusted, I could have rusted it. <laughs> I've got the stuff to do that. No, not rusted, just rustic. <laughs> rustic, yeah. yeah. I mean, it does have that kind of a little bit of like a rusty look in yeah. the corners, which is cool. I'm just tapping it on the top to make it look like it's dirty. Cool. Doesn't that look cool? Awesome. Thank you. You're welcome. I don't know if I'm going to do mine. I have actually a white antiquing cream I should try. Ooh. I think that would be cool on the paint. Yeah. yeah. And then, we'll, then I'll take them outside and spray them out. Spray them. Something good. And I think I'm going to use the white on mine. And uh, is there a white up here too? Is it over here? And then I got that stuff from. I wonder. I'll try both of them and see what happens. The vintage effect wash. Ooh. This stuff I got from Deco Arts. And I never even tried it yet. I don't think I did. I'm not sure if I did. I'm interested in how this works. Smells like paint. <laughs> like, why am I smelling this? Let's see what the directions say. Custom pickled, washed, and other faux finishes on home decor projects, yada yada yada. Cheaper average. Right Thanks, over. Frankie. Yeah, it's pretty much previously printed. That's pretty much what I'm going to do is like. Oh, good night, Escalab Escalabre. Escalabre. <laughs> <laughs> it's a mouthful, especially if we're not Spanish. as the antiquing cream really yeah it's the same thing he would do with that you just give it that kind of chalky look in your phone. Fluke said that her cats woke up and was looking around when the, they heard the dogs. Oh. <laughs> See you later, Escalambre. Have a good night. Oh, that's looking cool. Got some of your turquoise on my uh-oh. <laughs> it's okay. It doesn't matter. You gotta get covered. Yeah. Yeah, I like the white wash. That's kind of cool. Digging that. That's good for a shabby look. Yeah. Let's 
You got the rustic going on. I got the shabby going on. Thanks, Spanky. Does that one do the same as this one? What? That little bottle? Yeah. Like, I'll show you on the outside. I'll do the outside with that one and show you the difference. I don't care if it looks a little different. Don't bother me none. Well, it might make it a little darker on the outside or something. Mm, maybe. I don't remember. I'm trying to think if it looks lighter or darker than this. I think it might even be lighter than this. off and then I'll try the other one okay I don't remember what it looks like but I kind of like this matte chalky finish I don't think that gives exactly the same but I'm gonna it's a little thinner it's more see it's like watery it's more of a wash yes yeah, see it's more of a wash it doesn't exactly do the same thing yeah I don't like that as much you know, it's not, oh, yeah, no, it's it's not too, as dark. Yeah, it's not as dark. I like this because it's more of a whitewash. I kind of dig that. So I'm glad I got this out and remembered I had it. Oh, that's good. <clears throat> what were you kissing that your lips were burning? Oh, it's just cat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All that yeah. cold air today, I guess. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was really impressed with that boy, though, at that shop. Oh, yeah. The vape. Yeah. I mean, he was real helpful. The ones at home are just, they can care less. Yeah. Yeah, I hear people say that all the time. And the ones here are really good. And it might have to do with the fact that we started off in our group. And I think a lot of people in the group, like, it was important to them that people were knowledgeable. Yeah. And I think that, and a lot of the people that started that have shops started out in our group. So they prided themselves on customer service because we were, you know, our group was like full of a lot of newbies and it was important to us. And we were talking about Tigger enough. We were talking about what was important to us in a vape shop and everything. I know. He lost his so head. around here, I think they took heed of that. And this is cool. Okay. I love the white. I know he does. Leave him in. Yeah. Because he might get in their way. Yeah, you need to stay in, baby, okay? It'd be all right. Yeah, it's okay. All right, but I think we can take these out and spray them. So I can see what the hell they're doing, too. <laughs> all right. Pauline's going to entertain you guys. I'm going to take these out and spray the crap out of them. And Tigger, you're going to stay baby. here with Aunt Pauline yep. and be a good boy. You are. Come here. Yeah. He's like, Mama, oh, 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 no. Sorry, 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 buddy. You didn't mean to drop it on you. Uh oh. I'm having a nightmare. Come here, Tigger. <laughs> it's okay, buddy. How about we just chill out, okay? Yeah? Just chill out. All right, now you're going to stay here. You stay with Aunt Pauline. Come here. Come here. Go lay with Aunt Pauline. Did you start crafting, you know Teresa? I'm going to let him out because he might have to go potty. So okay. I'm going to let him go. Potty. Yeah, gotta let him go while you're out there. <clears throat> Where'd Janie go? She left. She left us during our live stream. She don't love us anymore.
What all did you get, Teresa? Come on. Away. Go sit in your chair. Come on. The door is completely blocked by a mattress. Uh oh. So. Okay, go sit up in the chair. All right, wait there, buddy, okay? So I just left them out there for now because I'm waiting to go get the other mattress. Yeah. Isn't it? So I'm going to have an intermission. I actually need to look for, for some images for okay. your boot. Ooh. Yeah, they've got one of the mattresses like right in front of the door. I was like, well, I guess I'm not going out there yet. <laughs> Are they having difficulties? No, I think this is the two of them are had to get the box spring first and then they're gonna get the mattress. Oh here's that distressing kit. It's got all kinds of stuff in it. Oops. Yeah, I don't know what. Like I'm I'm just confused on what oh, what it's for. Box. Oh, what does that say? Can you zoom it in? Distressing kit authentic making memory products designed to help keep you creative and create an antique distress look for scrapbook pages and scrap scrapbook pages with pumice cards and good more. lord okay wow that's crazy yeah it's pretty you, cool uh, yeah pretty cool well it's got that steel wool looks like yeah like that's why i was wondering is it for wood or metal or something because it had steel wool i never heard of using steel wool on I paper think, i think so i think <laughs> it's on paper They're yeah roughing up the edges and stuff i guess that sounds cool though yeah that's cool can i help you tigger <laughs> where was your crafting hall at was it online Teresa? No, go lay down, buddy. Okay, you're gonna oh, have to wait. You've got got it in hand, so it couldn't have been online. You don't know what to do with it. Well, you can distress things with it. <laughs> you know, I guess rub it on, rub the things on your paper, and see what happens. See if it gives you a distressed look, or like if you have like a wood box or something. You what can does it say it. inside the top of the box? Because it looks like it's got pictures and something. Yeah. I can't read it, but I wonder what all that stuff them powders are for. Huh. Is that embossing stuff? Mm, I, don't know. I don't know. It looks a lot fun to play with though, don't it? You got it at a flea market. Oh, okay. I think she said that. Didn't she say swap meat? market same thing she may have i might have just missed it cool yeah just play with it and see yeah. what you can do with it and see let what us happens. know yeah definitely i want to know what you do with it all right i need they to should look. have some kind of little uh, instructions to it computer or you can look it up online i'm sure there's a ton of youtube videos on it if it's a we yeah. are memory keepers thing so just look it up just look up we are you know the what it is and what it says on the box and i bet you somebody's using it all right i'm not gonna be able to see the chat for a minute ticker you need to go lay down till i can till the door is clear Cowboy boots. Tigger? 
Sit so down, okay? Listen, I want to wait. Out. I know, we gotta <laughs> wait, okay, buddy? All right, you want to sit on mommy's lap? All right, you can sit on mommy's lap. Ready? Jump. All right, sit down though, okay? You gotta sit down so we can find the image. You hear the girl's barking? Look at his head. He doesn't know where it's coming from because he hears it in the <laughs> thing. Oh no, where are they? Let them bark, buddy. It's okay. Okay? It's all right. Yeah, it's all right. They're just barking at daddy. It's okay. All right, let's look at the boots, buddy. A lot of, ooh, look at those. would be cool to have. <laughs> quiet. Oh, quiet. I could take any boot and make it smaller so it looked like a baby boot next to it or something. Yeah. Oh, there's some little ones. These? These have a thing. Oh, water mark through them. Oh, yeah. Tigger, sit. We're not going anywhere. We're sitting down, remember? Go back up a minute. Oh, uh, and that, look right there. This is racing. That's what he does. Horse something racing. Yeah. But he does car Stop, racing. Tigger. Shh. Shh. Quiet. Tigger. Yeah, I wouldn't. Oh, it's a t shirt. I don't think that one would be as good. Stop, Tigger. You need to just stop. Just give it a minute, buddy. There's the baby one. Oh, that's cute. I wonder if I could find like it like this, like where it's like, yeah. Well, that's this one hunched over, but like a mama and a baby boot together or something. That looks like a little one, that black. Yeah. With the hat, and then mm, there was I think a new the same, but it was way up there, but it had a one one boot standing and one boot kind of laying see if with I the can hat. Find let me go let him out real quick. It seems right. like I'm going to break my arm. Yeah. Hold on. I'll be right back. Come on, buddy. Stop being a pain in the ass. <sighs> I can't see the chat, ladies. Give us a minute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Bigger. Oh. Come on, buddy. Tigger, go back by mommy. Come on, Tigger. Tigger They're going to open the door. Come on. Tigger. Come on, Tigger. Come on, buddy. He's climbing on me. Hold on. Come on, Tigger. Tigger. Come on. Tigger, let's go. Come on, buddy. Let's go. Thanks. Mm -hmm. In you go, buddy. Good Lord. Help me get past. Dry. Put them over hither. My hands are covered in them. Okay, that kit has distress look on scrapbook pages. It includes edge scraper, paint comb, stipple brush, pounce wheel, and so much more. So much more? Yeah, in that kit. Yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff in there. I don't know what that stuff is. Yeah, I don't. What's in those little jars, Teresa? Look. Oh. I was all the way down at the bottom. Yeah. What, this is an announcement. It's a boy. Oh. <laughs> we might need to save that one. Well, we can't really save it because it's got somebody else's information on it. <laughs> well, I mean, we can get that deal off of it. Yeah. If she wants to go that route. All right, let me look up. Oh my gosh, you see them all moccasins. I know. Cute. I mean, big little cowboy would be cute if it was, I if you knew if it was a boy or a girl. That would be adorable, and the colors even match it. Yep. We need to do There's that. one. Oh yeah, look at oh look at the watermark on it. Damn oh, it. you can't take it out. No. That's perfect, ain't it cute? Oh, no, it is cute. Hey. We'll find another one, I'm sure. We'll find another one. Look at those little <laughs> <laughs> So oh, now you want to be in here with us. Mm -hmm. They're not barking Look anymore. Look at the bodies. They're out there getting attention. So he's like, oh, I want attention in here. <laughs> Give it to me. Alright, my other search was let's try that. What? Oh, so whole family. One. Yeah. <laughs> so there's one. Look, here's another one. Oh. And they're kind of like unisex colors. Look how cute. Uh, we're looking at boots online. We're trying to find a mama and baby stuff. Look at that. Oh, that's precious. Mama and baby boots. Ooh, they were sharp. Which one? <laughs> Damn. Oh, yeah. Look at that beautiful. That looks like Hannah. <laughs> that's the way she looked. 
all that higher. I think that one would work good. Well, I think there's two that we found that would work. Let's try. Let's see. I think that would be cute. Yeah. We can cut this. Mom, dad, and child. Yeah. Or this. I like that a little better. Yeah. All right. Let's save it on the desktop. And then I'm going to put it in a word and I'm going to print it. I'll measure how big we need to be. Okay, for those who don't know, this is the one that we picked here. That's the picture we're going to use. I'm going to measure the inside of that star and see. It's going to be cute. <clears throat> cute. My desk is disgusting. You had one here on the desk earlier. So about three and a half inches long. And about no more than three and a half inches wide. That's kind of work. Now it's my oblong, so that'll fit perfectly. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So let's say we want to bring it down to about there. And then I'll cut that top part off. I could probably crop it now, actually. With, um,. Somewhere over here. Review. 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 Review over here. Can you insert? I forget. I haven't used the crop on this in forever. Where the hell is it? Oh, you know what? I can probably get it from here, right? No, maybe not. No. Oh, this might be the older one. It might not have it in this one. I don't know if this is the newer one that's in my thing because they, they didn't have a crop on here for a long time. Doesn't matter, I can cut it. It doesn't make a freaking difference. That's all it's going to do anyway. So let me just print it. But I'm going to print it on cardstock. Put a piece of cardstock in. Yeah. She's like those jars are some kind of rub. Tigger, quit. Some kind of what? Rub. A rub. Okay. I looked it up online, Teresa, and it towed a... It showed like the one that you have with all the stuff in the box. Alright, girl. Listen up. Enough. 
I guess them rubs probably changes the color of it. Probably like a rust or something. No more hubbub. dry glossy and it looks like it's dry and glossy. That's not the case. Well it looks like this is dry and glossy. Which is really annoying me because I didn't pick glossy. Unless it's just not dry yet. How's it doing? It's dry and glossy unless I think it might not be that. No, it might not be dry and glossy because the sides are dry. I think it's just the inside's not dry yet. I was going to say, it's... We well, might can heat it if it doesn't. I want it's dry glossy, though. Kennedy's waiting for x-ray to be read. Good morning, Paulina. Well, she got actually that fast. What the hell does she live that she gets in? in the yeah, I need to get in and out of the hospital that quick. Yeah. Oh, no, that's not that good. I was really mad. This needs to dry. I like that white on that pink. Yeah. That's cool. Happy Mother's Day. Oh yeah, even in the corner is dried up. No, it's not glossy no more. Good night, Spanky. Good morning, yep. <laughs> Good night, Spanky. Happy Mother's Day. That's right, you live in like South Dakota or something. I forgot. This is going with her mom for breakfast for Mother's Day. There ain't no one here except a kid with stomach problems. It's a small town hospital. Ours is a small town hospital too, but you can't get in and out of there that quick. You're lucky if you can get out in two or three hours. Looks good. Awesome. Did I get your picture? Oh. Where is it? Oh. There. Okay, so this won't rub off, right? No. Because you sprayed really it, hard right? on it, Lord. But you but sprayed it, right? Yep. Let's see what it's so. The paint won't chip off. And then we could put a little How thing cute. around it, like a trim around it. How cute! That's cute! It is a cute! No, you can't even see that name really. If I put the trim over it, you wouldn't see it at all. I don't really see one, anyways. Yeah, there's like it was up there, but I shrunk the oh. picture so you can't really see it. But that would be cute with a trim around it. Mm -hmm. I have trims. That would be cute. Very cute. This way. 
Oh, wrong way. Sorry. Look, ladies. That's what it'll look like. Well, it'll, when we tack this down and then put a little trim around it for her daughter who's having the baby. A daddy boot, a mommy boot, and a baby boot. Thank you, Jude. This would be a good, like, pre-Mother's Day present for her. Yeah. Mother to be. Mm -hmm. Mother to be day. Let's see what kind of trim I have. Tigger, you're going to get run your ass over, boy. Come on, run your ass <laughs> over. We want a small trim. Where are my small trims? Oh, right here. <laughs> I don't want those. I don't want that pink. So... What, either a, like a brown or a green? Wait, or turquoise, I mean. You thinking brown? Well, I mean, you, if we can look at it and see how it looks. I'm thinking brown. I don't think I have a turquoise. How does the brown look around it? Oh, that looks cute. You like that one? Yeah, I do. And I'll put it all the way around so that it's yeah. like that a looks mixture cute, right sure. between the green and the brown. Yeah, I think that'll look really cute. I like it. That's cute. Oh yeah, that would be really cute with that. Around it. Look around the sides. Ooh, cute. Do you want me to glue it down? You want to do it? No, you can do it because you got your stuff over there. Your hot glue or whatever. I'm going to use aliens to put this down and then the hot glue to put that down. We got some bottles like that that the dog's medicine came in. Oh, really? And I'm going to wash them out and sterilize them and put my glue in. Good idea. I can't really squeeze in my lean bottles. Yeah, no, I can't either. That's why I use this because it's just easier to squeeze them and you don't have to, like, wait for it to go down too far. Yeah. Because it's small, so it just takes a few seconds for it to go down. And I got the fine liner things. Yeah, they don't work with Aileen's. Oh, so you can't hardly really squeeze it uh -uh. through them. You can't get Aileen's through a fine liner unless it's the the Aileen's quick dry is thinner. So you can't, I think you can get that through a fine liner, but I'm not sure. How's that look to you? That's good. Yeah. Cute. I love it. It's really cute. And we're going to put the trim on. Can you get me those little scissors, the ones that are sticking up? These? No, the ones with the funny handle. These? Yep. <laughs> those will be good for cutting this when I go to cut it. Boys and their baby. You two aren't giving me enough attention. I'm leaving. <laughs> Did they leave? 
Yeah, I so got, got the torso in there. there and I got the bed, so I'm assuming they're gone. Did he get his cherry pie? I don't think so. Oh well. You snooze your leaves. That didn't work out so well, did it? I guess I didn't press that down enough. It didn't stick. I was like, hey. Be cute if we had something to put in them little openings, you know, like the points. Some like kind what? of little something. Well, you know, like a little horseshoe on one, or you know, so some something cowboyish hmm. or cowgirl. Hmm. I don't think I have anything as far as that goes. I don't think I do either. You don't. Nope. I mean, what else would you want to put around it? I don't think you need to put too much anything else around it. Honestly. Oh, okay. It's pretty. Do it again. It's not on. <laughs> it's on, but. I have trouble getting this to stick down um, if I don't push it hard. Might be stuff on it, you think? Mm. I'm not pushing hard enough. I'm getting too gentle with it instead of giving it a good push down. Good morning, Katrine. Happy Mother's Day, Carmen. Happy Mother's Day to you. Katrine, say good morning, Stacy. Good morning, Katrine. Whoa, it thing's spazzing out. <laughs> My phone for you. Love it. Baby wipes. This mail. Baby wipes. Thank you. I'm trying to think of what I. I don't think you need anything in the corners. I well, I mean, I was just wondering. I think it's good. Okay. I mean, what do you guys think? You know, I think the rustic speaks for itself, and then yeah. this picture is enough. Because I wouldn't even know what you would put in the corner. I think that's cute. I think she'll like that. Yeah. And you can say, I made it. I will. When she comes in the morning. Be like, look what I made for you. It's only for Stacy made. I didn't make. <laughs> All I did was glue something down and spray it. You did the painting and the scrubbing and all that. 
to do what we made. <laughs> <laughs> so what are you going to do to yours? Thank you. I don't know. I don't know. You can see mine's got all that white patina stuff on there. Whatever it is, you can't see it. I ain't gonna focus. One starts going and the rest start going. Oh, you was gonna do pink pool crafts, wouldn't you? Yeah. I might. I, know. I might put it just, or just pink in the poodle. Yeah. I just put a pink poodle. Sorry, the dogs are barking like crazy. They're barking like crazy. They don't even know what they're barking at because Winnie will just start barking and then Tigger just barks oh, because yeah. Winnie's barking. But whatever. I think everybody left us. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Katrine. Well, I think we're going to actually end the live stream and I will finish this in another stream only because I think both of us are worn out and we just realized it was 2 a.m. And I know I'm exhausted because <laughs> I only slept a couple hours after the live stream I did. I, I was up by like nine this morning. So yeah, so we may have to do this, finish this another time just because Sounds good. I'm exhausted. I think Pauline's exhausted. And I got a piece of hair stuck in to the underneath of the spray. I'm just gonna add to the yeah. Just add to it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I can probably fall asleep in five minutes. But I gotta let the girls out to play for a little bit. Well, they're just gonna sleep out with me anyway, so I keep forgetting that. But anyway, thanks for hanging out, ladies. Good morning and good evening. Yeah. Good morning and good, good evening. Good night. And yeah. Happy Mother's Day. All that good stuff. Oh, yeah. Happy Mother's Day. Sorry, Carla. I might think about what I'm going to do with this exactly, and then I'll pick it up in the next stream and do something with it. Have a good night, everybody. Thanks for hanging out. Good night. Poodle Pack out. Pink Poodle Crafts, join the Poodle Pack. It's time to get creative and make you laugh. Make your own art today. Pink Poodle Crafts is the way. What a good boy.